Wow, shit. a perfect time for the sitcom laugh. Jesus Christ, that audio alert is so loud. I'm oh. so glad they re-added the sitcom laugh, it's my favourite. Um, hi everyone, uh, welcome to Forbidden Mystery Vault, your favourite show on Cable 2. Um, hi. Today we're playing Riley, Miss 2 uh, Ribbon, that's the name of it, it's called Miss 2 Ribbon. Um, yeah. And, uh, so you'll see on the stream right now, I need to just turn these fucking- On this off. network, I want joke. Um, yeah, I also want joke. But, 
You'll see that on this monitor adjustment page that I'm looking at right now, it says, please follow these instructions to ensure optimum color balance. Turn the contrast of your monitor up as high as it will go. If you can't see the symbol within the orange square above, turn the brightest of your monitor up until the symbol becomes visible. Slowly turn the brightest of your monitor down until the symbol within the orange square just turns black. So, the brightness stuff is fine. I can see the symbol, but my contrast is in fact up to max right now, which makes looking really? at anything white on my screen kind of hellish. This is the in-game advice for people using, like, 1990s tube television monitors. Listen, you have to <laughs> calibrate your monitors for optimal viewing. Thank they you, They just Andy. had fucking knobs on their monitors for doing this. Riley. You went through so much. It was pretty easy. I just have a button. You cannot go through the... Here's the thing. You have, in my personal opinion, you have to pick contrast and brightness you have to pick contrast settings brightness you can change but contrast and whatever the other one settings for your monitor are and you have to leave them there forever or you will begin to live in hell well i've i have taken the first steps and into hell man you will forget you will become obsessed with the idea that every color is wrong now that you uh, just in a, just five adjustments ago, your monitor looked better, but ah, uh, did it? <laughs> and then you'll put it back to there, and uh, I next will be my monitor roughly to um uh, for uh, print, uh, uh, so that if I draw so stuff, it'll look like how things are when I print them. The problem is that means that when I draw stuff, it looks nothing like what it looks like on people's screens. <laughs> Yeah, so um, I, 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 that, that is my plate as a digital artist. I have one screen that's small, that's my second screen, that just has garbage color. You just can't make it good. The screen's bad. It has low color count. Um, and then my main screen, for the longest time, it just fucking, like, bricked the red. Like, my red was too high, and any time I drew in red on, like, Photoshop or something, uh, there would be, like, artifacts... Um, Red artifacts. We've all been there. Yeah. I Most external computer that's... speakers are about the size and quality of the speaker in a common house phone. We highly recommend external stereo speakers for headphones. Well, they... if they highly recommend it, you have to do it. The audio quality in this game is genuinely just like vastly better than Mist One because this is a uh, swap the CD to go to the next area game. Sadly, we will not be able to show that on stream. I hope it just came with like a like ten CDs. <laughs> uh, it was a lot. Hang on, I'm gonna look up how many CDs Riven was on. It's just a black bar at the bottom of the screen, but if I shrink the window anymore, it will like cut out. Five CDs. Damn, nice. Uh, I think it's separated by island because for the first bit of the game. You go between islands with like a whole little train thing. Oh, that's such a cool intro. Yeah. The game's cool. Oh, hey. It's, oh, there is hey, we picked up right up. We picked up right where we left up. Yeah. Thank God you returned. So I don't know anything about a lot of mist. There you do some, some shit around, around some here. islands. Uh, you burn some know. books. We have to listen to interest. Yeah, there's no subject. I must continue my writing. This game was not made for people who couldn't hear. Yeah, the, the music is really loud and I can't hear what he's saying over the music. Well hidden. Do you want to know something? I played Riven and Not Mist, so I remember this guy. All reasons you'll discover. Hell yeah. with Only real Riven heads will remember this guy. Can't give you this. this guy's also in this. It appears to be a link. Only Riven heads will remember this guy. But it's actually a one man prison. You'll need it, I'm afraid, to capture Gan. Ganon? Gan. Oh. Once you've found Catherine. Signal me, and I'll come with a linking book. You're just back. 
I thought we were like had a whole thing going, Atreus. You're just sending me to go get your other your like wife. What happened? What? Ha what about us? He's in trouble. Was this She's nothing? I can't believe this, Atreus. You just sit there writing for years and years. I might be able to get you back to the place that you came from. TV world. Oh fuck, I've been tune stuck. This is a very cool effect, to be honest. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah it's it sick slaps. I, I think what they must have done right is had screens from the game shown through corrugated glass. Yeah! Oh, that's so loud. I had the volume turned up for the purpose of So that you could hear him, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it blew my fucking ears out. God, this, this game fucking slaps already. Yeah, this game is sick as hell. This is like the best point and click game ever made, except that it's not accessible, right. but... Whoa! We already this have guy. FMP! This is game is so much better than Mr. Ready. How much FMV did Mist have in it? Not a whole <laughs> lot. Please don't take my book. Please don't take my book. No, my book. You need that book to get back where you came from, right? Yeah. No, that's that's the uh that's the prison I need for Gan. Yeah, that's the prison book. Oh shit. He's such, a, we... he's such a guy that would be in Star Trek. <laughs> but like one of the episodes where they go to the past. Not the ones where they're in the future, because he's in the past. This looks sick yeah. graphics FMV wise. Yeah, it's a very pretty game. It's fucking gorgeous. It's got great sound and visuals and story hey. and Yeah. And they put FMV in the fucking world instead of just in books. Because FMV in Mist is like just in oh, a couple. Oh, of I books. love this guy. I love this guy. He's so cool. Yeah. Thanks, dude. He's like punk. Wait, did you just break my book? No, I broke the, the lever. Oh, okay. Well, kind of. I mean. You can go look at it now. Yeah. Okay, so this is a dad. So this guy that we we were asked, he's a dad. He's got some bad sons, and yeah. uh, all of his family members have been put into books that are prisons for some reason. And we he have to put his, his out. He, he put, put his, his son into prison books because uh, the, he was like, "Don't go in these books. They're not." They're not good books to go in. And then his sons did some fucking awful shit and were like, well, these are the only books we haven't been in. And then they yeah. imprisoned themselves. Um, and But his wife is missing. And so this is her age. And this is also where Gan is that you're supposed to put in another prison book. Yeah. And also, his sons are like super evil. Is this like the... Did the books get burned in this ending? Is that like the timeline that we're in or Yeah, this is the we we went into Atris's book with the mist page and like yeah. he can leave now. Uh we can go freely back and forth between where he is in Mist Island. Yeah. And he burned um, his the books with his sons in them. Which Yeah, scorched them up. Maybe killed them? I don't know. The status on his sons are kind of uh MIA, and there was a whole dating sim bit we were doing, and so eventually I went with the Atreus route, but now he just wants me to go find his wife, which is like... Oh, yeah. you're gonna so date typical. him, but... We I were married! Believe... He he was like, we I like came over to his house, and then he's like, well, thanks, you can stay here forever now, I guess, and then he just went back to writing, and that's all he did for years. And I was constantly like, hey, Atreus, 
Look at no, this. It... Uh, look at this like thing I drew, Riley. and he was just Riley. writing. No, Riley. No. Look it's at the clip. fine, okay. Riley. Look it's down. okay. I think you didn't want to be in a relationship with that guy, anyways. He sounds like he sucks. There he is. I take his okay, so this game has a significant amount of quality of life, mostly in the uh, context of your hand tells you exactly what you're doing. Yeah, uh, that's if good. it's hooked to the side, that means you're turning 180 degrees. Or I think it, yeah, it means you're turning oh, 180 degrees. Right. But if it's only pointing, you're turning 90 degrees. Mm -hmm. um, you got like ups and down pointing. There's, oh, I, can I just think. Go over this. Yeah. What? You could jump a fucking rail in a video game? That doesn't seem yeah. real. There's cliffs. It's fine. I can't um, believe they let you get up, go over a railing, and you can't even do anything on the other side of the railing. Well, I, I think there's something later. I think there's like an options menu or something for uh, transition speed too. Like you can change your settings for zip there mode and. Definitely is. I should probably just do. It's on fastest right now. What is zip yeah, mode? Yeah. Uh, so z what zip mode does is that when you've been somewhere before, it allows you to click a little yellow, uh, lightning bolt, like your mouse turns into a yellow lightning bolt. Um, and it'll skip like a walk down a hallway if you've done it already. I see. Uh, so it lets you go like much faster through the world, but also if you disable transitions, you can literally just spam clip. So it's up to you. Like how you I like the play. transitions though. Yeah. A thing I like about this game is that at a certain point you're kind of just walking around places you've been before a lot, and if you turn mm -hmm. and you have the option to turn off transitions and just like speed click, uh, and it feels way better than most point and click games because they don't let you do shit like that. This is a mysterious chamber. Yeah. This game is gorgeous. Yeah, yeah. it is. I knew I that really Mist and Riven had a reputation for being very good-looking games, both for the time and for now, but holy fuck. Yeah, like, Mist is fine. It's iconic. It was the first one. Riven is, like, it flawless. Is <laughs> I'm sure this game has a flaw in there once or twice. I mean, it's uh, lack it's, of it's accessibility a is a flaw, flaw, but... I yeah. personally, it, everything that people cite as flaws for this game, I think are fine, except for <laughs> like, you, they could have put like subtitles and closed captions in. But this is also from a time when I don't think people were consulting for video games. Uh, Probably not. Like, they weren't putting that amount of thought into it, which is a shame. Or if they were, it would be like, we got to bring in this heavy hitter to tell us how to make stats good. I yeah. think I think Road Gone hits the nail on the head. Like the comp the combination of the live and the CG parts is fucking gorgeous. Like this is like, like straight up. I think they do it better than like I was. Well, I was gonna say they do it better than a lot of movies. But here's the thing: is uh, that's because a lot of movies just shoot entirely with CG. Yeah. Uh, so Riley, this this is Atris's journal. It is the Book Mist Club of Riven. Okay. Um, do I need to read it now, or can I read it later? No, you can do the whole game without reading it, but it does give okay. you some context. It's the same as should, the, the books should, in this. I think you should read it in a storyteller's voice for us. Right now? I mean, you don't have to right now, but I okay. think you should at least uh, at some point. Yeah, well, we did the yeah. Book Mist Club last time, which was uh, an episode of The Mist where we just read books for two hours. So oh, we could, do we could do that. I think that would be fun. Yeah, this isn't going to be two hours. I don't think there's enough books in this game. Damn. You might get Catherine's the journal. They put all the book point. budget into CG. Yeah. I mean, it's also... It, this this game is one age, pretty much. Whereas Mist had a bunch of them. So there's yeah. less extensive backstory. This is a podcasting... That's a microphone. This is a podcasting throne. <laughs> It is. That is a podcasting <laughs> throne. I love, I love, I love the phrase "podcasting throne" because that implies that podcasters have status. <laughs> I look a similar. Take a page. look. It's in a book. Reading Riven. 
Fuck. Fish. Riley, I have a question. Fish with the fruit. Did you properly prepare for this by reading uh, the companion book to Mist? The no. book of Atris? No. Damn. This well, is I haven't really... either. I don't know if you guys know this, but this is really bright with max contrast. <laughs> you oh, can yeah. turn the contrast down, hun. It's not gonna change what we see, I don't think. But no, it will but change I'm... what we see because it's on your monitor, but it will deplete your experience. Yeah, I'm like, I'm experiencing Riven 100%. Uh, You're experiencing look... like 80%. <sighs> Whatever your contrast is, it's that much percent. That's how much of the game you're getting right now. Yeah, I yeah. don't think 100% contrast looks good. I would guess. Uh, I'm gonna apply the shocker filter to mist. Okay, you know what? I'll try. I'm gonna. <laughs> uh, my contrast is on 73 right now. I'm gonna turn it up to 100. I'm gonna write down 73 so that you don't. Yeah, this just makes everything bleached out. It's well, you also have you also have to adjust the uh, the brightness so that the symbol is only barely visible. Well, I already yeah. did that. It already was. Yeah, but now it might be different because the contrast is different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You'll have to tweak it some more, babe. <laughs> no, I am not willing to do more than this for a bit that isn't funny. Are you are you changing are you are you changing it back then? Yeah, I put it back to seventy three because it was seventy four. You said seventy four. No, you're gaslighting me. <laughs> colors will look wrong otherwise. Babe, I uh, literally thing. wrote it down. <laughs> oh, Babe, speaking of writing it down, wrong. Riley, um, you should definitely have a place to write things down in this game. Uh, yeah. This game is oh. going to be way more of a groan if you don't write anything down as you find it. Yeah, because yeah. there are two huge puzzles in the game that are like the most significant puzzles in the entire game. And you only do them at the end. And they require knowledge from everywhere in the game. It's spread out across the whole fucking game. Whoa, a raid. What do I have to Holy write down shit. now? Oh, you'll you'll see. It'll, it's going to be pretty obvious when there's clues. Okay. Well, it's like Lava Lana. Yeah. God. Uh, they, should make the a Lama... they should make a ribbon that's as hard as Lava Lana, but still like a ribbon. I don't know how you would do that. Maybe to make people take reading comprehension tests every few screens. They should make a three dimensional Lama Lana. That would be sick. I think that would be sick. I'm excited for the Long and Lana Devs next game, which they said, we're really bad at timelines, so I'm going to give you the title and uh, check back in several years. Yeah. Which I kind of respect. Yeah. I'm, I'm sharpening uh, Riven for you so that it will look better. Hey, I'm... Gonna be real. I'm turning my contrast down because my <laughs> eyes hurt. <laughs> yeah, let's Thank please, you, please Riley. look at this game and like a it's beautiful it's... game. Please don't hurt your eyes looking at it. I want you to enjoy the experience. Whoa, double lever. A lever both ways. Here you go. Oh, it's so it's so nostalgic for me. I have no fucking idea. All these I've, sounds. I've sharpened uh, Riven for you. Oh, I'm gonna look at this, and it's not gonna look good. I bet. I think it's gonna look great. I think Dom's an artist. I'm something of an artist myself. Yeah. Riley, can you put this image on stream real quick? Yeah. This is this Just... is two hundred percent Riven. This is what happens if you put your sharpness uh, high enough, and it's more ribbon than usual. What? It's more ribbon than the recommended dosage. I think the monitor setting I'm using puzzle. right now doesn't even use sharpness. <laughs> yeah, I, sharpness right is kind of a weird word for a lot of stuff. Oh, someone brought up the Book of Atreus, and now I'm just sad. 
Is it bad? I don't know. I didn't read the Miss Trilogy back when I had discerning taste, but it is really frustrating that, like, Cyan Worlds wrangled the Dominion over the Mist series back from Ubisoft between Mist 4 and 5, and then Mist 5 makes absolutely no goddamn sense if you didn't, like, read all the books, because there's just too much lore and shit in there, and they're trying to, like, wrap everything up. Uh, yeah, that is frustrating. Like, that stuff's supposed to be a fun little spice, not necessary. Yeah, as much I was as I like, joked about Riley needing to read it before the game, but that was the, a joke. The fact that I'm like reading the dialogue shit and listening to the voice acting in Miss Five, and I'm like, somebody mentioned Tiana. Tiana's not a character in the games. <laughs> She's not there. She might be mentioned in Uru, but Uru has a bunch of shit you're not even supposed to understand on a personal level. Mm -hmm. I do I don't think confident Moxie it takes to subtitle your game the sequel to the last game we made. It's because they wouldn't let them just call it Riven. Yeah. God. It's the same as uh fucking Glass Onion and Knives Out story. It's like they got forced to put that shit on there. It's because no so one loud. it's because no one likes a thing that is just the thing it is. People only like a thing when it's uh Instead of murder mystery, it's Star Wars a murder mystery. Well, I think it is understandable to be like, hey, you liked this thing and you're excited for the other thing, and it's very easy to just miss. Missed. Or missed, in this case. That, like, there is a new thing that is, like, in that series. Like, uh, I, I do understand the idea. It's like, it's, yeah, it's, it's a weird one, right? Because... I'll confess, like, oh. I love, I love shit, like, fucking, I love, like, a fucking murder mystery, or, like, I love a fucking, like, noir thing, but the problem is, all the directors that would do, like, a murder mystery or a noir thing, by and large, are, like, the only jobs they can get are doing a Marvel TM noir, I'm not watching that, I don't like Superman. Yeah. Alright, we gotta let, we gotta let Riley listen to this, so. Oh, yeah. Got rolled ball, babe. That's like a bird. All right, so there's a thing. There's a there's a thing to write down, and there's like a plot. Like, oh, this sounds like a bird or something, right? Jot down some of whatever, whatever will make you remember the sound. You sound like my plot, like a fucking math teacher. Oh. So, <laughs> I love math. Uh, <laughs> so you're saying we're going to be writing down the sounds of balls all throughout the game? Yeah. You're, we need we're to be paying be very close attention to balls. That's what we're going to be about. really inspecting these balls. Uh, it's in this game. Balls in the King of the Kingdom. <laughs> in it, I, I do think it's funny that you mentioned math, math Riley, because that thing. Uh, that's <laughs> a number. Oh, no. That symbol? It's every That's every... a number. <laughs> oh. Hey, don't, don't spoil too much. Riley should figure out when things are numbers. I kind of I guess yeah. also the thing is is that this is just reminding me about fucking Rama, a game where you have to solve alien math, which is just math in different bases with alien symbols. Yeah, oh, really? that uh, kicks ass. Is it there, is there a game of Rama? The, I didn't know that. All it kicks ass. All of the, I love all it. Of the, all of the puzzles of math. I hate math so much. It makes me want to rip my brain out. I didn't, they're, I didn't they're realize very there was cool. a game of Rama. That makes like so much sense. That fucking that fucking had... would make a perfect point and click adventure. Yeah, it the has funny... FMV of Arthur C. Clarke, and he makes fun of you every time you die. <laughs> yeah, he goes, he's like, you fucking idiot! You shouldn't have thought about that before you walked into this area and then happened to collide with one of the roaming enemies in this point and click adventure game. Also, hi, yeah. a strange fool. Thank you for the raid with twelve viewers. A game wow, that makes me think you. I heard Ranma every time. <laughs> I think I think I think I'm loving the I'm loving the idea of like fucking it's it's a fun little slice of life anime. Uh, where we're, we we're stuck inside a giant tube with octo spiders. <laughs> Rendezvous with Ranma one half. <laughs> also, um, fucking. 
someone uh, already made the joke that I was going to make earlier, which is that, or just said the thing that I was going to say earlier, which is that I think all public transit should be unrailed like this, and I agree. I think all public transit should look like that. This is the yeah. goal. It, it's 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 just the, the the optimum the optimum format. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of rides they, in this they game. Uh, they put a... Oh, go ahead. I was just saying there's a lot of rides in this game, and you don't have to drive any of them, and that is a huge improvement over any other form yeah. of transit, including the one in this one that you yeah. did have to drive. Also, I... <laughs> it just uh, they just uh, it... Riven in Riven they they progress to socialism. I don't know what I was what I'm talking about. They yeah. they, they started well, a tram on my street. There's... And it's got like ads for an arms dealer on it. Oh god. No. <laughs> they were like they were like, oh how are we gonna fund our, our tram? It's taken like fucking ten years to make. Oh I know, we'll put an ad for like an arms dealer that sells shit to the outer dome on it. <laughs> also thank you for following Metacor X. <laughs> thank you. Uh, for the thank you for this big raid and welcome all the cable too. Uh, uh, it's a, a threat and a promise. The future of live really... video television. Metacore says I know I a really... few trans it's who are yeah. pretty public. Okay, <laughs> all right. I know that was I'm about the joke, but I. <laughs> I'm a I'm a transit who's pretty public. I would say. Yeah. Also, Does that make me a train? I yeah. If you want to be, you could you, you could be a trains, trains gender. Means gender. Mm. Trains mm -hmm. gender. Oh, I'm not it's laughing at this your bit train. is so good. Pick, let me pick it up. Let me pick up the axe. Let me let me no. wield it. This game does not have an inventory system. Really, actually, it does. www do <laughs> Dot com. <laughs> I got fucking blindsided by the big follows. I fucking love that sound alert. <laughs> I'm so glad they brought back big follows. I've missed it so. I've missed it it's so. It's so loud. <laughs> the audio sound alerts are not balanced at all. Also, this is really beautiful. This I can see this. This looks like my house. This is, looks like the view from my house. Except it's not like that. Your, big, it's very your house is your house is pretty. Normal. It sounds like this is innocent. Hey Riley, can you send me the uh... kind of desolate? Can I send you what the like notification thing again, so I can open it up in Discord again? I hate not oh, hearing sure. Cable Two notifications. They're so fun. Let me. I mean, I, I, the way the way to do that is just to stream your OBS, but. Then we won't hear yeah, the but then audio. you don't hear the great Riven audio. Yeah, yeah. I I need to hear Riven audio. It's important to me. It's true. If they don't, if 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 it doesn't hear Riven audio, it'll literally fucking die. Yeah, I'm just like sort of going around. No better way to scare up the new people than using the sound alerts. Yeah, especially the extremely loud big follows one. <laughs> well. Yeah, because they're like, oh fuck, it's that famous big follows bot that follows you bigly. <laughs> yeah, we're already doing this. You have walked Whoa. past so much shit, Riley. Whoa! We are already This is a this. fucking roller coaster. Yeah. Can we get a cable to I wanna say I that like first, I the game. That first tram, Riley, that was disc two. Oh. This is about when I stopped uh, uh, playing uh, Riven because I got scared. Damn. I was a child. Anyway, uh, this is disc three at the end of this ride. You I know just you're just I'm fucking blowing through fucking blue and discs. fucking winning this game. Oh yeah, it's yeah. speedrun time. We're just walking past stats. tons of this shit. It's it's because it's because each of these graphics is one megabyte. <laughs> it's honestly fun. I think it's it's neat. Like it's been yeah. I, I can't even remember playing this game for the first time. So, watching Riley do this is like, wow, this is like a completely different trajectory from like what I'm used to, where I like know to go and look at a bunch of stuff. Oh! Yeah! They put my ass in the pit. Got also, dumped in the chute. 
Someone said, can, Strife said, can we get a KL2 balance update that audio balances all the sound alerts? I think there was talk of that at one point, but I don't know if it will ever happen. Maybe I think there should be a... Uh, there's auto balance all the sound alerts using a compression, but the compressor can be adjusted with... Uh, this network, I want joke. You know, a compressor wouldn't be that bad an idea. There is almost certainly a compressor add-on for OBS. Yeah, they're absolutely. OBS can run Wait, VSTs. Is that like a wood chipper? Was I going to no. get something a wood chipper? Yeah. Oh. Wait, I thought you meant the compressor. I thought you, you thought a compressor was a wood chipper. <laughs> well, I mean, you can compress wood chips a lot easier than you can the human body. I'm just fucking going. Look at that. Look at that lake. Yeah. You can apply a limiter in OBS, but I'll talk to Avi about doing it ahead of time in OBS recently. Yeah, I could just limit them myself. I mostly just uh, reduce their audio uh, as yeah. necessary. Technically, you should just be able to like normalize everything in Audacity or whatever, and it'll be fine. Uh, but also, audio. I love when the screen goes blue because the, the spigot is moving. Oh, my screen's not going blue. What do you mean? No, just like there's a tiny square of the screen that goes blue sunscreen. around the sunscreen around the would be sunscreen. The uh, long-term benefits of sunscreen have been proved by sunscreen, whereas the rest of my sunscreen has no basis more reliable than my own sunscreen. <laughs> I will dispense the sunscreen. <laughs> I. This is an alien spaceship question mark. This is a big a splash of water. Oil oil oil. Oh, this is a silo. This is like. Uh, I think this is a reservoir. I love anyway. This show. Yeah, getting dumped in here is fun because I'm pretty sure you can't leave until you solve the puzzle. I could be wrong. There could be a way out. Isn't it nice that you have those little little bumps to tell you yeah. what's going on? Yeah. <clears throat> this is essentially how search engine optimization works. True. This is how search engine optimization works. It's a yeah. time, it's they they move a little tap. Tube. Goes in there. Oh, nothing right now, but you can disconnect it from the tube below. There's so many weavers. Yeah, it's like a real fucking puzzle. Well, that probably helps with something. That probably does something. That one probably does something too. I made it stop bubbling, so I guess I turned it off. Well, I guess it turned off the heat. Yeah, now I can go in. Ah, uh, what a cool door. Yeah, it's a cool door. Rating, this... rating Mist Game doors. That one? Mist Game I mean, door, Tailist. It's not the best door. Mm, so it's still full of water. Still full of wawa. Wa 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 wa. What? I fucking love water. I fucking love water. Hang on, I'm gonna take a drink right fucking now. Ah, delicious. Oh, yeah. This pipe doesn't. That's belong. Echo, the water-loving beast. Hey, I did it. You did it. I feel like way more than anything in Mist. This feels like this game does a really good job of going like, okay, there was some like basic shit in Mist, but this feels like a thing that people use. Yeah. Like you're this... figuring out a real contraption that serves a purpose. Yeah, it's just a purpose that is not 
like it is alien to you at the start. Yeah. Oh, tube. Tube. It's so dark in this tube. <laughs> I like the little. Hmm. I don't know if I can do anything. I think in you this can. Tube while it's pitch can black. you keep clicking? I don't oh, know. Oh, I can. Oh yeah. Uh, this is scary. This Hell is where yeah. the tube comes out. Oh. Hell yeah, it is, sister. <laughs> so, in in Riven, you're not going to a bunch of different worlds. You're just riding trains around to different parts of one world. It's named Riven. Yeah. Yeah. It's got a few islands instead of just being one island. Also, there are no people here except for one guy who died and then got dragged away by presumably another person. Yeah, there's people here. That's there's a there's a place that Riley walked past that kind of gives us some some insight on that. Yeah. There's also a place that Riley is kind of walking towards that also gives us some insight on a different side of things. Eh, oh, I what? love this. I love this part. Oh, I, I want Riley to show. solve this. I want Riley to solve the fucking. Yep. What is the big lever? This puzzle. Do? What does it do if it's closed? Fuck. It's a grill. Make some mistakes. I'm gonna make some mistakes. Hmm. I love the pellet. I love. The can I just? I want to put oh, so many I of think these you pellets can... in my inventory. I want to pick up all. Can you can look you up more than this one screen? Pellet? I don't. I'm. I'm trying to remember where all this stuff is. I don't actually remember the solution to this puzzle because I'm pretty sure you can bypass it with something else. Um. It seems like some sort of trap to catch an animal. Yeah. In a colander, so that they can be drained. Yeah, well, you you don't want to catch an animal in the way that'll hurt it. And you don't want you to breed that. Out. Yeah, what is up of here? It's uh, a fan. That's to dry the animal. It feels like there's maybe a hint in another area we need. Um. If Echo's saying, um, that's probably not true. No, I, you're kind of right. I don't know how to describe how I'm feeling about this. Is this a bullshit puzzle? This is, uh, okay, so... You put you can put a pellet onto this little what looks like a pressure plate and then a trap, right? Mm -hmm. Um, I don't remember if the lever is just after you do it, but what do you usually do if you put food in a trap? Like if you set a trap for something, you leave it open, right? right? Yeah, you leave. <laughs> you leave. I don't. I'm pretty sure there's a way to manipulate it so that something happens. Uh, with you still here, but I'm pretty sure what they intended for you to do is to leave that there and then just like completely leave and go to a new area. I guess so. Oh my god! But there is a there is a really funny RNG manip. It might be that they want you to like go back down here or something. I don't know. Just come back to it. Explore some more. Find another puzzle. That was definitely so a problems. Metroidvania you opened a shortcut right there, so... Yeah, yeah, it felt like it. Hey, how do I now go you back? Can do... I want to go back to the other to the other places. Oh, I could tell you, but I think it's a bit of a spoiler. Um, You can leave this area. I'll tell you that. Well, there's a ladder. There's the ladder. Thanks, yeah, for, the the ladder thanks for the 100 bits for the Chicago-style hot dog. I think you might actually. 
Oh, there's another ladder. Climb, climb the chute. Climb the chute. Can't. Too slippery. Okay. No use now. Oh, shoot. Too slippery. Have you gone down that dock? Uh, I'm not looking at a so. guide or anything. This is just my stream of consciousness. Your stream, Your stream of consciousness. Of consciousness? Your river uh, of consciousness? Your... My ribbon of consciousness. Take me back. I love oh the God. subtle shift whenever something uh, goes into a pre-rendered video in old games. Yeah. That's so good. Down we go. No, Let's no. go. Oh. 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 Raise your hand. Oh. It's Don't a raise your hand. Whoa. Don't, oh. like. Whoa. Don't, Don't oh. raise your hand. There's just tiny oh. rings. You're gonna. I'm hitting. Hit I'm on. hitting all the oh. rings as the I go. I was them. really scared of these. <laughs> God, Dom. <dumb. laughs> you ripped a huge bird. This I didn't even hear it. So I was too busy enjoying this roller coaster. <laughs> I'm not crazy, right? Someone burped? No, no. yeah, that abs absolutely. Someone burped. I didn't burp. Well, I regardless, just... Matilda, I that was the thing you were so scared of that you quit Ribbon? Yeah, I was a I child. I can see it. Yeah, no, I, I see like it. it. It's okay. I considered uh, making fun of past you as a bit, and then I decided, you know what? I don't want to do that. I think if adult you were scared of, of that, maybe we could make fun of you if it doesn't make you uncomfortable. But child, <laughs> no, I see it. Children are scared of a lot of things. Yeah, I was scared of Poison Ivy from the joke Batman I mean, that's, movie that's... with the nipple suits because she could mind control people. Oh. With her sexy pheromones. <laughs> and I was too young to understand what sexy was. So I was just like, <laughs> she's mind controlling people. Oh, God. I had a fucking nightmare about it. <laughs> it's like one of Echo, my earliest Echo memories. Reveals all and, oh shit, a bug. Oh, yes, look at yeah. this little oh, guy! Oh, look at this little guy! No, oh, no, 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 no. shh, shh. Oh. It was making noises. It makes a little noise. It makes a little bug noise. It makes a little buzzing bug noise. When we find when you find an animal, it's important to pause the commentary for a moment so Riley can hear the noise. <laughs> You, Echo, we gotta let Riley find out that the bug is important. Well, I don't know. If, I don't remember if this bug is important. Model. The pieces fit together tightly That's fair. enough to be airtight and act That's as an fair. inverted siphon, carrying water down one side of a valley Thank and up the other. Thank you for these informative uh, yeah. aqueducts. About Riley. I'm pretty sure there's like red herring animals in this game. I don't remember, but I think some of them don't. Like, I don't know. I just want Riley to not have to like get stuck at that point in in the game where she's like I didn't write anything down. Um and I, I am have very to walk appreciative around the of the entire fucking island. Yeah, can you I really appreciate telling me what I need to write down even if you don't tell me what I need like why I need it. I just I'm I'm bad at taking notes. Generally animal sounds. Just yeah. anything having to do with animal sounds. If you think there's an animal, all sound right, involved. Riley, write down these birds. Write down that there's birds here. They might be re The bird sounds here might be relevant. I don't remember. Birds here. That's what I wrote down. With an exclamation mark. Birds here. I rem. I you remember gotta, usually. You gotta say for dead so you're gonna forget. Say usually when I here, play mushrooms. Sorry, Echo. You go. No, it's fine. Usually Not when bad. I play through this game, I miss something. So like. Don't don't expect me to have like comprehensive guide knowledge on this stuff. I just know the gist. <laughs> this game is very fun to stumble around in. Yeah, it's very. I like it a lot more than Mist is so far in that sense because Mist was like a lot more tightly packed, which was good. Look at that guy. Um, yeah, no sky guy. guy. Yeah. Yeah. Whereas this is kind of directionless in an interesting way. <laughs> yeah. Your story just plopped in a world and said, "All right." There's a way to get to an ending. Figure it out, Buster. Ribbon is like one big age, but it's styled in a similar way to other Mist ages. Because like the ages in Mist are like, there's a way to leave and there's you have to find the pages. So you're basically just exploring to find out how to leave and how to get the pages. And there's usually a puzzle involved. 
Riven is kind of like that, but it's big as hell. So Atris hands you a prison book, goes, you need to trap Gen in it. He says something about finding Catherine uh, and dumps you in this age with no way to leave. And that's what you're doing. And Gen is Atris's bad yeah. dad? Question mark? Maybe. I, I don't know. I don't know who the I don't know if is. I should tell you. I think it's in the Atris's journal. Um, what? Oh, they. He's got a kid, a little child. Riley, very, clearly very pleased at how much more FMV this game has. I'm yeah. extremely. Yeah. I can sense it's, it. That's what this show is. It's literally the name of this show. Yeah. Oh, they don't oh we should. It. Hang on. I need to look up this the hidden FMV thing in this game. There's a hidden FMV thing. There's a hidden there's a hidden thing. I think it requires waiting in one space for a really long time. It's basically it's close to the end of the game. So okay. don't worry about it playing today. Um What if I just got to the end of the game today though? Wouldn't that be impressive? Wouldn't that be cool? I I don't it think that's happening, happen. but sure. <laughs> I'll tell you, but you know. Because I know that I know the like area it's in. Here it is. I'm sorry for fidgeting with your door knocker. I just, it's really funny. Okay. Okay, no, it's not waiting. It's uh, clicking a specific thing. And it will have South going, Yeah, I'm in this video game too. <laughs> <laughs> I want to play this drum. There's a drum. No, it's, it's not your pot. fucking drum. There's clearly some sort of thing to put a thing on that has a. Do you, do you recognize that thing you put thing yeah, on? It's a fish. It's the yeah, fish it's the god. fish again. I love the fish god. My favorite. Of all the this game, this game has a lot of creatures. Fish god, top tier. What's up? I think that so, was Riley getting pulled away by someone in real life. Yeah, well, Riley's away. I think it's important that we talk about uh, a little known fact about Riven, and that is that in Riven, when you beat the game, um, it traps you. Huh? It imprint. Huh? What? Huh? I huh? Think, wait, hold on. Huh? Uh, Riley, Riley, hold. No, I don't think. For a moment. Yeah, Riley. What's that? What's Close my ears? That? Okay. Yeah, yeah, close your ears. Like, is it in a cage? Is it in some kind of object? Does uh, it put you, the player, in Riven forever? It puts... Yeah, it trips you in a book. Um, It's like a prison book. Hey, guys. Book. I hope everyone's having a great stream. Uh, there, so there's, like, a whole bunch of books in... Wait, Dom, um, didn't you say that you played... Oh, wait, you quit because you were scared, right? I, I quit because I was scared, yeah. I didn't get trapped in a book. I, my fear saved me. Yeah. I got trapped in a book, but luckily I, I got to about. trick some fucking poor sap into letting me out by putting all the pages in, so I, that's all right. Um, I don't, I don't, know if I I don't think Riley will be able to do that. Yeah, She's Riley's... Nice. You've got a killer instinct. She's really bad at at lying. It's just not her thing. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted uh, like everyone to know that so that we, you know, so don't share the same piece. fate. Yeah. Could we? We can stop the stream. Riley doesn't have to be trapped in a book. No, no, no. We can get Riley. Oh, well, uh, like, sorry, sorry. Sorry, it's sorry, yeah. a really funny video. I'm we, just we have not to looking not at the tell stream her. right okay. now. I guess I know why only. Ten people have ever beaten Riven, and you're one of them now. Yeah. Oh, that's such a. All right, Riley, you can come back in. <laughs> Sorry, I was watching a really funny video. What, what Riley? <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, I was watching a really funny video while I was not listening. While I was not <laughs> <laughs> is that yeah. is that the one where it says it's a knife? 
<laughs> no, it's... <laughs> Is it the Greg Sky? That's my favorite one. Is it the one where a dog's his gorp? It's got a dog in it, but it's not it's not the gorp dog. It's hang on, I'm gonna I'm put a link to it in the Twitch chat so we can watch this funny video. Oh holy shit, what a funny video. Uh okay, here we go. I found it. It's this, it's this video. This is the video. Okay. Uh, okay, I'm glad that none of the people in the stream will be able to see this. No, I'm, no, I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put a browser source on the stream. Is it gonna load? Is it gonna load? This, it's not gonna load. this is a video. Yeah, it was really funny. Oh, fuck. Can someone post that in the Twitch chat? Also, holy shit. I'm crying. Oh my god. It was so funny. Okay, well, I hope you guys had a good talk about whatever it was you were talking about. Yeah. I think it's good you're going to be crying out of the way now. <laughs> yeah. That way you won't be crying as much later. Hey, don't you think this kind of looks like a I... boob? A little bit. I mean, Not until you I, don't said think that. You, I don't think you had to see it like that, but it's just sorry. It's just my irreverent, or you know, my irreverent silly style, my irreverent humor. Could you imagine like the alarm getting sounded, everyone hiding in their homes, you're hiding in your home, and this person just comes in and just starts fucking clacking about in your well, fucking I love to just soul. fucking clack about. I love to click on Greebles. I love to click on Greebles. <sighs> oh, what's this do? Oh, God. How do I activate this lever while I'm in the summary? You... I think you can look at it after you send it down. Oh, okay. I don't know if you can climb down there, but... Maybe I have to jump down and take my legs. I'm pretty sure most of the time... Yeah, that's a little far, but you know, I was down there. Is that a pizza? Is that a pizza? Is it a delicious pizza? Delicious pizza. If it was a pizza, I'd be eating it. Wow, I said some sounds there that <laughs> hopefully conveyed my meaning. They certainly weren't the correct words. <sighs> Thank you for making sounds, Echo. We really appreciate it out here. And yeah. uh, the sound makers. Oh, they closed all the bridges. They don't, they don't want me to go for the bridges. Oh, wait, this one. Uh, that one's the one I already went across. Yeah. Uh, hmm. Does it look like I can do a tunnel stuff here? Nay, I'll hold like a cigar in her mouth while saying this. I did, nah, have the key. Not... I did have an object in my mouth, but not a cigar. Wait, fuck, that sounds horny. God damn it. That wasn't the it intent. Doesn't. It doesn't. You're fine. It does now, but I mean. <laughs> You're okay. I don't know that I'm ever going to be okay again. <laughs> hey. Stripe says, huh? I wasn't assuming Pegasus. <laughs> huh? Hey, I wasn't Stripes. assuming I just have some bad faith people in my life who leap to assuming thing like Pegasus all the time. <laughs> yeah, it's very frustrating when you're trying to just talk to someone and you can't even use a bunch of English language words in any context. You can't say things <laughs> like fucking 
penetrate These men. We're just innocent yeah. men. And yeah. we all know how I love penetration. I just want to call things moist sometimes, you know? I just want to call things wet. I think that should be allowed. I should be allowed to say that a fish is wet. <laughs> Got something to say to me, Riley? <laughs> no. Just chuckling. Just, just sort of that funny video again. Uh, also, yeah. new hit story, like... those who walk away from Pengus. That's what Strike <laughs> says. Those who walk away from Pengus. As you know, we here at Cable 2 are rated T for teens. This is as explicit as it gets, and you're only allowed to say fuck once. Oh, fuck. Yeah, fuck! Shit! <laughs> Shit! Whoa! Ass of ball. Look at that guy! Oh, hold on. It's like oh. a place you saw but a horse. Oh. They ran. You made them scared. All right, Riley. What what noise did it make? Did the, uh, uh, did the bird go? I kind of went. Oh god, my. Trying to make a bit about how children learn what yeah. animals sound like. It kind of went like. Yay! Thanks. Good job, bulb. Riley. I can't believe they have a light bulb. Oh my god, we're up to this guy's container. No, this is a different container. Yeah. Aww. I mean, there might also be a guy in there. I don't know. Ooh, Sand pit. Yeah. Yeah. Sand pit Sand with the ball. Look at the ball. I love ball. Oh, it's we a water pit. I love ball. Damn, a water pit's the opposite of a sound pit. Sand pit. Oh my god, I forgot. Oh my god. This game really needed this. EI. I think that was a bug noise. Yeah, that was bug noise. Could be a bug noise. It could be kind of like a buzzing, uh, like a bad microphone or headphone. I hate to tell you this, but bugs do be buzzing. It could be like uh, a hummingbird. Buzzing. buzzing tables. You would do that for me. You would just yeah. like serve and not, not eat. Ever again. What? Holding my microphone. To you. Would you be willing to never eat? No. I like mm. to eat. I like to eat hamburger. Gosh, every time, every time I'm on a fucking stream, so much is hamburgers, and it's been fucking years. <laughs> no hamburgers, freckle. I've been eating hot. I've been like. I've been like incorporate. I've incorporated a hot dog, like because hot dogs are like a good, easy, cheap food. I've incorporated them into my lifestyle after being on cable two so much and everyone getting Chicago style hot dogs. I'm like, fuck, I want a hot dog, and now I've just been eating hot dogs. Only the now you're the hot dog dogs. woman. Yeah, that's what they call me. Hey Echo, have I been too you much of the jokey combativeness, combativeness stuff? Oh, uh, you could do it a little more, I think. That would be fine. <laughs> okay. Sounds We good. don't have Troka here, so I need somebody to just, like, be a huge... Uh, huge I don't know what insult no to... I don't know what to... Oh, <laughs> I was like, I don't know what insult to call Troka when Troka's not here. <laughs> yeah, Echo and Troka... Echo and Troka sort of resonate off of each other. Uh... I have noticed their absurd otherworldly. It's sort horrible. of like putting like a guitar next to an amp. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, which one of us is the guitar and which one is the amp? Trunk is the amp, you're the guitar. Hell yeah. I get all the attention. Do, do make a guitar noise immediately. That's cartoon. Incorrect. That's cartoon horny noise. Band. That's 
Yeah, you're going to be banned from Twitch for fucking uh, making us all visualize like a wolf uh, <laughs> whose eyes are popping out of his head. That's fucking yeah, anti. Yeah, That's yeah, like yeah. against TOS. Oh, yeah, you can we... imagine like a, a horny wolf or like a kiss. Like, fucking, they'll send, like, the NSA to your house. And I hate Star Trek, the original series. I love <laughs> the Twitch chat right now because it's so incomprehensible. Morel says, whoa, <laughs> your whammy is insane, flushed emoji. And then <laughs> Kelly says, now that sound was a pangus. I think we've scared off every single person who joined in that raid. <laughs> Hang on, yeah. let me look at it. Yeah, there there were 29 people for a bit, and uh, 12 people came in that raid. Yep, and now we're down to 16. I don't know if that's how that works, because I Twitch is, always feels like yeah. its viewer count is lying to me, but I don't know. Yeah, yeah, the viewer count is lying because it's based on cookies, so if folks have their cookies turned off, it fucks with it. Huh. Stretching my arms, stretching my arms, stretching my arms, you guys do this video again. Yeah, I realized that I turned around. Whoopsies. I mean, you can't you can just keep going that way. It's not, it's not the end of the world. But also... What's this one, dude? Is that like the... Break? It... There are... There are two-way wide intersections on this track. I see. Twitch group count is only useful as a very vague ballpark, yeah. Yeah, but now it's down to 15, which means we need to uh, scrap the stream and start doing something that more viewers like, like Counter-Strike. Okay, yeah. Counter-Strike Counter -Strike original, not CSGO. Original. Just... Yeah. We need to play Team Fortress 1. Which one? Which Team Fortress 1? There's two. Wait, what? what? Okay, there so there's Team are. Fortress. Yeah, so there's Quake World Team Fortress, uh, which is the original original, and then Valve buys the rights and they make Team Fortress, which would then become Team Fortress Classic, which is a source okay. mod. Oh. oh. Quake so One Team Fortress Quake, sounds like Team Fortress Zero to me. It's kind of Team Fortress Zero. Yeah, it's it's not on the Source engine. Uh, the. Sorry, the Team Fortress Classic is on Gold Source. Then Team Fortress 2 is on Source. Team Fortress 3 is it just Team Fortress like... 2. But uh, with a bunch of extra depth added onto it. Wait, there's a Team Fortress 3? I just call I just call um Modern Team Fortress 2 Team Fortress 3 because it's basically a completely different game. That's... Yeah. I've never played I... that one. Valve does love to erase the history of thing of projects that they've taken on so that nobody knows they existed before them. Yeah. Yeah, 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 holes. yeah. Holes in the water. This looks like a delicious jello. Hmm. Well, this does something somewhere. It didn't change the holes, which is what I thought it might do. Yeah, same. Maybe it needs to be hooked up to something? I love how this whole time we've not really found a puzzle that we could do. Well, we did the water the thing to puzzle. go through the big tube, yeah. That's true. I, think... I guess I wasn't paying enough attention. Reservoir puzzle, I think, is a pretty common one for, like, the first puzzle you do, unless you do one that is, uh, we have walked past. Yeah. But it's very easy to just kind of get yourself stuck. Yeah, and we still can't even get out of this zone, right? No, I can get out of this zone, because I can just go, I, because, like, I got out of the zone with the reservoir in it, and I can go back right. further, but I've just been exploring this zone, because, like, I have, I can do it. Yeah, there's a lot of really good stuff here, so. There's a lot of really good stuff everywhere. I don't know why I'm saying that. Yeah, um, this is the zone where you get the double jump. Yeah. Yeah, yeah but, the, like, you don't get, the, like, the grapple hook here, right? Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't have dash either. Like, 
Double jump isn't actually as good as you think it is without Moth Wing Cloak. Mm, yeah, you're you're not wrong. Because it's it's really hard to like Monarch Wings through like the through Gans the fucking... uh, through Gans projectiles through, through Gans Fortress. Gans, through Gans Fortress. <laughs> Gans Fortress Path of Pain. Yeah. Can you get out of this pot before you learn the Song of Time, though? Uh, that's how you swap ages, actually. Yeah. Song. Yeah, they. That's why they're called ages. It's because it's time. I actually don't know why they called them ages. It's a really weird name for like a world. Yeah, it kind of gives it a time travel vibe when that is in fact not what's happening. Yeah. There is a whole age in Uru about a guy who is trying to fake time travel. Which I That's think funny. is cool. I love Uru a lot. Uh, I want to eat the water jello so bad. <laughs> it does look so tasty, is, is the problem with it. Can you it not looks get like, out? I'm looking at that and I'm like... I couldn't, mm. I couldn't get out. Huh. I guess like you gotta the, do something else. Yeah, the ladder was too far away. Oh, so you gotta... Okay. Hey, I remember when you said that you don't pilot any of the vehicles yourself? Yeah, you don't pilot this. This is piloting. This is piloting. No, this is conducting, Riley. It's a train. I'm gonna. I saw a train. It's I'm on the gonna fucking floor. Fucking dismember you. <laughs> Don't dismember fucking Echo. So wait, are you going through portals in the water? No, those are, that's just going. Okay. There's like these, the holes. Yeah. I'm back where I started. The holes. The yeah, holes? like the movie. Holes. Like the book. Oh, holes. I've seen that movie. I like. I liked it. Miss, I've never miss, seen that movie before. Huh? It's about uh, making reparations for racism. I was it on cable two or on Riley's no. original stream where we no. just spent an entire time talking about holes. Yeah, it was on La Milana stream. Uh, we okay. spent like yeah, hours talking Lexi. about the movie Holes, and Lexi was so fucking annoyed because Lexi was like, "I don't know anything <laughs> about this movie," and I only knew about it because I read the book in high school. And I've never it's, seen the movie, it's, it's, so it's, it's, it was. They're, they're like prison is a form of domination. I'm like, yeah. Domination? Did someone say domination? Yeah. <laughs> Dalmationer. Dalmation. Oh, like the dog. Yeah. You want to know my, the the story behind my famous username Dalmationer? Sure. Yes. Uh. I went on the Team Fortress Classic server, but I didn't have a username. And if you don't have a username, it just assigns you as player. Oh. But then, and I. So then I, but when I was on there, it was a server that basically, if you were just called player to prevent like bots, it just randomly assigned you the name of a dog. And it was a French server, so it assigned me uh, Dalmatiner. Which is French for Dalmationer, and then I misspelled it because I like the name. Wow. Oh, nice. Huh. Yeah. Hmm. Anyway, yeah. that's my uh, that's my that's my t uh, my Tilly secret. Well, that's, that's your cool. Tilly backstory. Secret backstory. Yeah. I love of Tilly. I love little username facts like that. I always feel a little conflicted because I don't have any like that. Well, but I mean, there's a lot well, of folks. What did you pay for? Oh, Echo is just my name. It's because I'm trans, and I oh. thought about a lot of names. And I was like, this isn't... I wanted a name that was a word, but still sounded, like, relatively name-ish. Not just, like... Mm -hmm. I don't know. It might have been because I wasn't cool enough yet to pick a name just, like, Soup or something. No, Soup is a real name. Like, Dirt. Yeah, but I just Echo has a good vibe. My name. It does have a good vibe. I like it. I like it. I, I was yeah. tempted to pick my name 
the same name as an OC I used to play in Space Station 13, but then I didn't because that would be cringe. But then my mate, who also played on that Space Station 13 server, did exactly that thing, and now I feel like I missed a trick. That said, I'm quite <laughs> happy with my name. Yeah. yeah, I mean, if you're happy with your name, that's the that's the main goal. Yeah. It's just like internet usernames is very common for for a lot of people. I think to have like interesting backstories to like a long running name. Yeah, I have and... I have a very long backstory to my name, which is that I originally went by. Well, I don't need to get into that. I don't want to actually assign myself to in case just in the very very rare scenario that someone recognizes me from many years ago from Neopets. No, oh. from I wasn't ever on Neopets from fucking forums, but anyway, I okay. went by from the MSPA and... forums. No, I wasn't actually on the MSPA forums, despite Good. the illegal time. Um, but anyway, I was on I was Pumpkin for a while. S Pumpkin with an U. Wait, shit, yeah. that was you? Yeah, with an umlaut over the U. Fuck, I didn't realize yeah. that, huh? Um, and then I eventually. Like, this was I, I rebranded when I was still in Eagle Time, but then I rebranded to Spryly because uh, I was like, I want a username that basically just has my name in it because when I hear my name, my ears perk up. Uh, and also, I just like it better. And also, because my other one was just like too Halloween themed when Halloween, like, isn't in like it's I like it, but it's not like my brand or anything or like my aesthetic. Also, uh, it yeah. happens once a year, whereas yeah. Riley happens every time. Also, it's not even autumn in Halloween where I live, because of Tammy's views. Yeah. Oh yeah. I will. I want to interject for a moment to talk about okay. how extremely narratively cool like this this room is. Yeah. Look. Oh, I see. It's a scary. scary. I like his little head nod. He's so cool. This man's like a genie or something. Oh, that... genie. Yeah. This does seem to be some sort of school. Yes. Oh. I love a lot this game and the school, the school room is very important because this is a school, and of course, a school and a puzzle game would be important. Um, I think that Hangman game that you didn't manage to interact with, there's something you can click on it. Because mm. it, I want to say it's the ring. Can you click the ring on the right? Oh, I see. Yeah. It went down how many times? Oh, I didn't count. It went down uh, nine times. Oh, okay, thank you. Uh, also, Merle said my wife's name is Mud, that's a great name. And yeah, that Kelly is said I named myself after a fictional demon I pretended to be once with a plausibly standard nickname. That's good. Uh, but anyway, so Spumpkin turned into Spryly because I wanted something that sort of fit my vibe. Uh, and also had my name in it, and also uh, still had an umlaut, and still had SP at the front of it. Uh, and so I put the umlaut over the I instead. And I've just kept this for uh, years, and I just use S-P-R-I-I-L-Y when I can't use an umlaut. Or th three no. eyes if you can't use two eyes. Yep, yeah, because I can't use two eyes on Twitch, because some fucker has... Two eyes spryly if you're It's chat. it's against TOS to have two eyes. That's true. Yeah, that person doesn't fucking stream or anything. I had an old Twitch username that was like that, where it had to be slightly different. What are you gonna use those eyes for? Probably bulging out and like going Yamana Yamana hooey, yeah. what a hottie. Yeah. I truly love how 
I have not understood what's going on with a single puzzle object in this game. It's oh, teaching this... me numbers. Yeah. Oh, that's so clever. I love I love that. That's I love so... that you like go to the like the school to like fucking learn all the oh, oh yeah, here's this this world's counting system. Cuz it yeah, Why it does it do some... it with like a fucking noose? Oh. Though? Oh, they're not. Oh, well, they're hanging it by their feet. But yeah. Oh, I want to spoil something the way that you said that. I want to. I want to fucking talk. Ah, this game is so good. Oh fuck. Echo, it's okay. We'll get to it. It's not even like an explicit part of the narrative, like as like a a fucking like plot spoiler. I guess it's just like a setting spoiler. Mm -hmm. Um, but also like. Riven is good because the setting is the story. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Kaleva, Kaleva was already taken by someone who streamed World of Warcraft once ten years ago, and that boils my blood. Yeah, Twitch uh, is the worst. Pretty good. I think you would like it. Was that that's Choka? I think I think they should just uh. I think they should just let anyone have any username and have uh, people will be allowed to make have multiples. Yeah, and you could maybe I use like a you... unique identifier code or something at the end of that to make it so that there's like a. For... I mean, the other one is just purpose. like instead of having one big twitch, have lots of small twitches where each one yeah. you just. Uh... Maybe even you wouldn't even need to stream. You could just. Uh... Posts like game facts. <laughs> yeah. I wonder if it like requires you to figure out the pattern here if it has all the numbers. I need to find out what that because I missed it. No, like I couldn't tell what that number was because he got eaten. Yeah. I mean, there's not really much I can do, right? Like I can't do. There's no other input that I can find that other than yeah. Just... Um, but there's also like I don't know if all of the numbers are in here because there is like a small pattern to like the numbers that I think you have to learn. <laughs> That's two. Yeah. I, I think we've seen three. Yeah, we've seen three. What, What's the bird what, noise? What numbers do you have? One, three, seven, nine. One, two, three, seven, nine. Okay. So. Yeah, because it's it's eaten on specific numbers. Like on in, like not not that it's eaten on purpose on those numbers, but more mm -hmm. that it's like those numbers that we don't know yet. Oh. Six. Is it like, oh yeah, it's how many times you drop. Yeah. God. I think you could, through like the process of elimination, figure out every number as you find it in the world now with like what you have mm. um okay. do you i can i can i like point out something i don't know sure i feel like i've been i've been like pointing out a lot of stuff and i don't want to i the thing is echo is that i love being directed in games i love being told but... where i'm going <laughs> So some of I mean like the within the numbers like a pattern. Okay. Sure. Um some of the numbers are more complicated, right? Mm -hmm. Like I think the higher numbers. Um but in like a very specific way. Um yeah. I know you hate math, but could you see some similarities between like, are there are there any numbers that have like the same component to them? The same, like, I mean, like part of it is the same. Two and seven, and six and nine, kind of. 
Uh, and there was another one that I didn't see that had the symbol from three, the like K, but yeah, uh... six and nine. Wait, yeah, I guess kind of, but um, so what's the difference between two and seven? There's a line down the middle. Well, across the middle. I should like open a notepad pro program and just like have it on the screen so I can do note taking like live. Yeah, but it would be really hard to. You would have to have like MS Paint or something because you're you have symbols that you can't yeah. type. Um, which I is why convert, like this is I made might for pencil my notes to MS Paint because I think that would be really funny. Yeah. Um. So what what numbers have that line through the middle? Six, you have? nine, seven. Oh, no, I don't know. I'm trying not to just say it, but I don't know how to give hints. I'm so bad at hints. So bad at hints. The information I have drawn attention to has a key to discovering a, one or more numbers that you don't have. Well, I think at least two numbers that you don't have. Thanks. No, wait. No, you do have everything you need because you have nine. I forgot about nine. Yep. Um. Do I have a real like component visible? Yeah. Okay. Is there similarities between one and six? Yeah, because they have a line yeah. in the middle. So. Yeah. Mathematically, what's the difference between one and six? Five. What's the difference between two and seven? Also five. I see. Yeah. I don't know if it gives you a five eventually, if but like that thing takes a long time to cycle through. Yeah, I think there are further patterns once you get above ten, but I don't think this game does that. It doesn't go Pretty above sure 10. There's... Yeah, I don't think this game needs to go above 10. It might. It might go to like 12 or something, but... I don't know. It's not a base 12 system, so you're fine. You're safe. Oh, thank God. Well... I guess technically it would be base 5. Yeah, huh. yeah, it's base five. Hey, I'm back. We have we got base five math in here. Yep, which is basically just base ten math, but with less numbers. Hell yeah! Just I hate like it when base, we got it. I hate it when three. we got numbers. Base three is is base ten math, but with three less num even less numbers. Well, no base. You can't uh, base one easily is divide. Like, it's three uh, is not a factor of ten. Base one is that's just the same as base ten. Uh, base one. Wait, I don't think that's possible. Can you have a base one? Uh, yeah, it's just tally marks. Yeah, I guess. I guess you are right. Except like way more irritating tally marks because there's technically. <laughs> yeah, because tally marks is sort of a weird base two. Or like a weird yeah. base five? I don't know. It's like a notation method for a base one, I guess. Yeah. But wouldn't a space also... Like, because base two is, is binary. And tally mark still has nothing. Put... Does that count? Mm. Like if there's no mark? No. That's just a, a delineation between each number. 
it I still think, feels wrong that you could have a base one. number system without because like base one theoretically would just be zero which means that you can't have numbers because there's only zero i guess that i guess i don't know because i then but wouldn't that mean that I guess I, I guess you're right. I guess that is kind of still like a. Well, no, because it is simpler than binary. Because binary has two states. It has on and off. This. Only this would has, just have. It only has on. No, I think it would only have off. Because we start at zero. You can't have one without zero. Oh. Yeah. <gasps> Mm. Yeah, yeah, they're fucking having fun. Oh, I love the creature. One thing is the value of each digit. Hmm. Riley, can I tell you something really quick? I have to not scare them off. You can jump railings. Oh, fuck. Oh my god, can you go down and see? Can you go down and see him? I mean, they run away, but... Uh... <laughs> yeah, this game, I think that would probably be a flaw of this game, is that it doesn't communicate super well where you can walk. But also, like, just click everywhere, right? Just click everywhere. I don't think that's... That's a justification for pixel hunting. Well, kind of... No, it's not pixel hunting, because nothing is the size of a pixel. I think yeah, an adventure game that expects good... you to click everywhere but doesn't make any, like, really small shit that isn't obvious, that's fine. Because, like, it's an adventure game. If you're not clicking everywhere, what are you fucking doing? There's a bunch of areas that it's hard to tell if are relevant to anything, which is kind of cool. Yeah. It makes like, it, it makes place... feel a bit bigger. Is, is this a place that will be useful to you in some way, or is it just here because it's cool to walk around a lake? Who could say? Well... I can tell you something. This game has zip mode, and that gives you a little bit of an insight in some places as to whether things are relevant. Because <laughs> you can get the ability to zip past to like a whole hallway, and that means there's nothing there. Ooh, cool staircase. Yeah, I'm going to go back to the first zone. Can I do anything more there? I can't, right? Um... I think you can, but I don't think it's going to be super helpful right, right now. The problem is, is that I don't even know what helpful would be because I don't know what I'm trying to do. I don't really have any, like, puzzles that I'm working on. There was the levers. There was the ladder that I couldn't access. Well, there's also the animal the mouse trap. trap. Yeah, mouse uh, trap. That's probably gonna... I don't remember if there's something more with the mouse trap because, like I said, I think you can just kind of skip it if you know a really cool secret detail that no new player should be expected to know. Um, I get to watch this cool cutscene, which is that actually the main character has been a mouse, a mouse the whole time, so you only need yourself to solve any mouse-related puzzles. <laughs> oh my god, it's on the mouse. I love the image of, like, just a fucking mouse appearing and it just going, Welcome, my friend. I need your help. <laughs> like giving you a big fucking book. Moused. It's moused. I do yeah. love most. I do love that, like, the book that Atreus was writing in for, like, the whole time you saw him in Mist 1 is the one that you're in right now. <laughs> the big big fucking book. I like your little song. Yeah, I wanted to join in. I didn't ask if I could join in, but... It's okay. The, the one I was doing was, uh... Oh, I'm thinking. The one I was doing was I was uh, humming part of Viking by Frank Goshen. Oh. 
Usually when I'm humming a song, I'm just making it up. So I make up songs a lot, but this time I happen to be doing a specific one. But okay. a lot of the times so I will just make noises to make cool sounds. Yeah. It's just fun to ad lib like a little melody with your mouth. It's simply fun just to make a sound. Okay, Welcome you do to have to do something. I don't know what it Dave? is. Yeah. Yeah. You might have to turn off the fan. I don't know how you turn off the fan. Probably have to go somewhere above here. That would well. But you could also you can zoom in on the fan, so maybe there's a thing on the fan screen. Jam my fingers think... in there. Jan, just fucking jam that whole little mist hand Put the that book. fan. That'd be funny. Put Atrus's Never... journal in there. Oh, I love you, man. <laughs> I... <laughs> It does seem to be none of the puzzles we've uh, encountered have had any sort of feedback on what they're for at all. Um, Echo, you seem like you were so, sad about me leaving that puzzle that I have no fucking clue what I'm doing. Oh, I wasn't sad at all. I'm just I'm enjoying there's a little there's a little thing here. Uh, I don't know how you're supposed to figure it out. I think. Yeah, I don't know how you're supposed to figure it out. That might have been a rat. Or was that a bird? Was oh, that right there, the rat's noise. No. Hmm. Nothing. Uh, I... You need to be able to do something with this lever that you cannot do right now because it doesn't work, is the answer. Okay. It's because you of that. You need to go somewhere else guy. to make a thing work. It's because that red guy going about breaking all the levers with hammers. True. Oh, my. He hates them. Yeah. He hates levers. It's even better. I'm, I'm enjoying this a lot. Well, okay. Now I'm back to... I'm enjoying this because I, I do... No rem I know what to do. I could... Hmm. Oh. That was a nice. terpy... Little trippy friend. <laughs> Maybe you aren't supposed to notice it. I'm so baffled because, like, I'm trying to put myself in the head of like Cyan Worlds people who made this game, and I'm like, so how are you supposed to figure it out? How are you supposed to figure out some things that I know about? Because I remember there are things in this game that I just like sat there with my sibling and my dad and we just sat there and we just didn't know what to do for like hours. Is that what you're supposed to do? Yeah, you're supposed to just sit there with your dad. Yeah. If you don't have a dad, you can't actually win this game. Mist is a game. Mist and Ravenna. It is a dad dads. game. It is a dad, yeah, dad game. game. Yeah, I agree. I agree. It's I a dad it game, but dad. you de you definitely need to do something with that lever, which seems to be providing power to different areas of this zone. I think it's providing water. Is the thing. I'm gonna refill this tank and see if. I yeah, but water is power, you know. Yeah. Wow, that's insightful. I meant like hydraulics. Well, I, I guess say you this did. Every day. You know, the solution to pollution is dilution. Huh? Hey, thanks, Riley. You're welcome. Is that true? I don't know. It's just a thing that Jaunt said on the Happy Lab Accident stream, and no, it's just a thing that I think about sometimes. Mm -hmm. Oh, I guess that is what you're. I don't know. Because yeah, there's a little, there's a little heat. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 
cries, sobs, wails, explodes. I don't know. Is that this is this isn't me giving you a hint. This is me genuinely asking. Is is that other lever? Because there's the other lever that's like way out in the middle. Yeah, that determines the flow of water. It seems. But I guess I could flow the water to the other zone. Where I don't know where it's flowing right now. Go, right now, go it's back going to, the, the to the trap cave. Go back to the trap cave. Okay. Yeah, that's what I would have tried. Is like moving it, trying to direct the water to the trap. Oh, cave. okay. Now I'm zipping. I wasn't zipping before. Yeah, yeah you kind of got to find the central point Hold on the screen is there, where the game zips you. Is there other areas in this walkway, like to the left and right, because we can jump things? No, nope. that's no. 180 degrees. Go forwards. Now, no, There's... not that forwards. If it like if you're go go back to the trap. I want to sh uh, turn around. Oh. Yeah! Oh. oh, you got it. That's not what I was telling you to do, which means you did it all by yourself. <laughs> I'm so proud of you, Riley. My puzzle, my puzzle Your skill puzzle. evolved. Level up. Skill increase. Your puzzle skill still increase, babe. Whales. <laughs> Give me I still think there's rack. a component of leaving and coming back. You do definitely still need to leave it and come back, but... I think you can just, like, walk down to the edge of the pathway and back or something like that. I don't think you have to go. Is there anything else like... that I can do right now that I've like just completely missed? I mean, like I think this thing is going to happen in this general area. Mm -hmm. I don't think you have to like. I'm just thinking about it. I'm just thinking about it. I don't know if it's like, I don't remember there... how it works, but I remember just like walking walking around this area to get it to trigger. I think that there are parts of this area that you haven't discovered yet. Oh, I know for a fact there are parts of this area that Riley hasn't discovered yet, and I'm giggling. I'm giggling about it. There's nowhere I can walk. I'm clicking everywhere. <laughs> Riley, I'm just click on for a while. Don't Don't come back later. Naya, if you've like looked at a guide and you know, don't say anything. I don't. I, I, I have looked at a guide, but I genuinely don't know which bit I know, I'm supposed to know. Okay, just don't say anything except about the trap. I know that there's this walkway here, but I have no fucking clue how to get to it. <laughs> are, are there? Don't don't. Down. This is not a specific hint. The thing I was going to say is not really as... Okay, Echo. That's You know what? Yeah. I was telling you not to spoil things earlier. So I've spoiled I... quite a bit. I want this one to be a true organic moment. Oh, I love an organic moment. Those are some of my favorite yeah. ones. I hate organic moments. I love things being <laughs> crafted and arbitrated. Yeah, survival game fan. You like to craft things oh yeah true i didn't really if you like to craft things. things and not to just get natural items i recommend the game warframe you can't fucking get anything in that game without crafting it you can't even it takes and, and like they really make you like savor the crafting oh, as well I, yeah lord i just i i Naya's see gonna what get, is gonna... now. yeah naya sees what it is don't uh, that is so stupid. How would you ever figure it's that out? Really funny. Uh, I think you figure it out because if you if you succeed, if you. If I mean, you I think if you succeed here, in doing it, it is really obvious. But how would you? Know but if, it? but I think it, there's a way to come around, like another way. We should stop dancing around this and just shut up. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, because yeah, that's actually way more annoying than just not saying it or just saying it. You're right. Okay. That's why I said yeah, we just, to shut the fuck up. Yeah, we're just not saying it. Okay, so I don't know. I want to see this animal thing get solved because the last time I played this game, I just didn't do it. Yeah, so I want to know. I want to know how you All can right, tell. Please retrieve mouse. Please give me Please mouse. retrieve mouse. Please give me mouse. Please. Yay. Yeah. Open that mouth. Bring him out. The frog. Well, that's the that's not a fucking mouse. Whoa! I think I recognize that noise. Did Did you catch that frog, or did he just go to? Did he just fuck no. off? Nah, it just left. Do you need to catch the frog, or is that? Yeah, no, it, you just need it. It's frog sound. It yeah, it tells you what sound the frog makes. That is very very important. This is so funny. So there <laughs> there is like no. Game. <laughs> okay. This game sucks. Positive. No, this game is good. I I like that. Oh, oh I, like, I I said positive. This game is good. Positive. This game is flawless. This... Echo, I'm gonna like write a hit piece on Riven because I'm just I I'm so angry about not knowing what the fuck to do. So, you can go all the way back to where you started, right? Yeah. And you said that I can't do anything important there? Um, I th I'm pretty sure you can. There's, like, the thing is, um, the, like, path between islands becomes a little less linear. Eventually, you get to an island that will just show you the map. It, it like, allows you to access in a really cool way the map of, like, every island. Um, but before you get there, there should be, like, multiple ways of going between places. Like, this island you're on right now, there's another way to get to this island. I don't remember exactly where it is. There's, like, a cool elevator that you can do really early in the game, uh, that I don't remember, again, exactly where it is, but I'm pretty sure you can access it if you walk around enough. The... whether or not you can do something at this stage of the game is largely just, like, wandering around and getting your bearings because as i said there's puzzle solutions that have to do with just kind of going everywhere so being able to get everywhere is the battle right now yeah millennium cyber says so after you beat miss three exile are we starting a cable to uru server genuinely i am tempted to it, maybe look into setting up private service stuff because you can set up private was... service stuff for Uru, and I do... Okay. Wait, is there a multiplayer this... mist? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, let me talk about this for a second. Okay, so uh, Uru Ages Beyond Mist is the offline conversion of the Cyan Worlds game that was made after Mist 4, or during Mist 4, I don't remember, called Mist Online Uru Live. Um, Uru has... It is, it is an MMO game where you have a really shitty 3d character model that you run around in 3d third person or first person there is a jumping component that's dog shit there is running versus walking which is also relevant in a couple of the worst puzzles in the game however it has really fun storytelling really cool ages you can play through the ages with friends if you're on one of the like an online mmo server with them um and also the full version of the game it took them a while to come out with these ex like expansion ages has ages that you specifically need to be online to do there's a few ages that are like really small but you need a bunch of people to operate them like within the time constraints um that's really cool that sounds quite there's cool. There's also a few ages that are based on schedule, like clock times, where you get this like solution from going into an age at like a specific time of day. Um, and you like piece together a couple like little micro ages by going into them at the right time. And those oh, are also you fun. You to be able to do all sorts of shit. There's also like a main, there's a main like 
uh, the hub world has like fun little doodads that you can interact with. And in general, it's like a really bad game as far as playing it with people for any amount of time beyond like accomplishing these things. But it's a nifty little hangout. And I, I guarantee you could do something fun with like a stream for it. Yeah, I think it would be um, fun to do a streamed like Cable Two, Cable Two takes on Uru. Even though there's no way can be on a yeah. sounds fucking cool as shit. Yeah, it's ex I I love Uru a lot. It has some of my favorite stories, like that one about time yeah. travel. There's huh. the one. Mm -hmm. This is just one huge like douchebag guy that it talks about a lot because he was like a really big deal. On uh, in Dunny, and there's a bunch of ages that are just like about how much he sucked because like he wrote ages. Uh, it's funny because so Echo's like, definitely out. like explained a lot of Mist games to me before, and I think I've watched Echo play Riven, but I've just like completely forgotten all of it. Ah! Hey. Oh, this is a cool room. I didn't like that. That's spooky. Is it, were you briefly you, in this room? I was. I yeah. wasn't paying attention. You want to know something fun about that too? What? Um. Down the hall from here, there's, there's a cage one. with a microphone that you sit in that allows you to view this room. I see. Oh god. Um, oh god. <laughs> That's terrifying. <laughs> Wait, oh, what's so it's one? like a it's like a weird like fake god thing. Yeah. Yeah. That's but that means that that means that presumably he was on the other end of it looking at me. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, he being Gan, I believe. But the god. person who is I don't know who it is yet, but it's like a spooky guy who was the like god at the school like the hologram at the school teaching people game court says right. wait is restoring the books of mist in violation of the righteous strike uh well that... we're just we're trying to trap a guy in a book right now yeah yeah yeah, yeah. right the the writers are specifically trying to stop being trapped in the book books and wait. books and movies are different books movies and tv are all different things but it's a, okay but to write TV... books a TV and a movie are made of a book. No! They're, They're made, made of, of a book. screenplay! You, you combine That's two book. books to make a movie. You combine two books to make TV. You combine two TV to make movie. That's like, it's like one of those idol games where you like marriage things. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's like, a, it's like uh, crafting. But movies existed before TV. Okay, so book, TV. So it's combined two books book make movie combine two movie i'm movie and book and you get tv i mean that makes sense right because a tv right a tv is just a bunch of small movies true i don't know that i agree with that i think it is i think it's a bunch of small movies instead of a one big one that you get to make lots of small one i'll Sometimes... make you lots of small one what does this mean you make me several smaller matilda Yep. No, no, Nea's gonna use her secret slicing technique. Her EI Jitsu. Oh. She's gonna slice you to 1,000 cuts. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Sure. Like 1,000 cuts. Beetle room! Beetle room! Ah, so I see. I, I, mm, I see. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this guy's an asshole. Fuck. This guy, so can... this guy is like the. This guy is uh, treating himself as God because he was the author of it, connected to this universe or wrote this yeah. universe or however the fuck mist works. I would love to just to now bring your attention to the fact that we were in, uh, we, at the beginning of the game when we first linked here, there was a guy who like kind of adjusted his speech and was trying to remember like a way to to communicate with us. Um, and a place that we were just in was a schoolhouse where this guy who's pretending to be a god was the teacher. Mm -hmm. 
Wait, do we need to know it's... about that beetle now? Maybe so. So he threw away a guy with a book into the ocean, uh, trapping them in prison. There are there is a number here, by the way. I think oh, yeah, these are the these will tell you like That's which fine. one is the first. I don't know, but yeah, dude with a book cast into. A oh, he's cleft. he's the guy that put his son in a book. Or wow. he threw his 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 son in the book. He fell. I don't know. Is there a number here? Oh, maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong about that. Can I read that? Yeah. This game, I don't think, is very concerned with teaching you how to read Dunny. Uh, yeah. I don't think any game is concerned with teaching you how to read Dunny, except maybe Uru, because you can. It's for nerds. It's for the real mist freaks out there. And so so in Mist, when you write a book, are you creating universes or just making portals to them? You should read the Mist novels. <laughs> uh, uh, but I believe it's the second thing. Yeah, basically the Mist novels are about how everybody who sucks and is a massive prick uh, believes that you are creating the worlds. <laughs> and everybody who is not a massive piece of shit uh, does not believe that you are creating the worlds. I see. It is possible to alter worlds with the writing, though. After you have linked to them, you can write things into the book and cause them to happen. Worshipping the book. Oh, the meat grinder. That's what the wood chipper is for, to print, to make more pages. And that's why all those trees were cut down. Mm. I guess it's actually good we came here after all that other stuff. Instead of just walking in here originally. And then they had paper and progress and knives and compass. Knives. This guy does not represent himself very flatteringly in his stained glass form. I mean, he probably didn't make the art, right? I guess. Yeah, I don't think he made it. He probably. And then he. It, it was probably some artisan that made it, right? Yeah, I don't know what this is about. Guy with guy with book falling into cleft is the first cutscene in Mist. That's true. Atris cast himself into the starry expanse. And immediately knew that he didn't know where the book to mist, where the linking book to mist would end up, and it falls in front of you, and you go to mist. That's true. Women love to go to mist. Which I think is fun because this clearly signifies that this god figure cast Atris into the cleft with the book, and yeah. at the beginning of mist, you are told that Atris jumped in. Um, I see. He was not thrown in. <laughs> yeah. Interesting. Also, I'd be completely incapable of interpreting interpreting these images myself. I would just see there's a guy and there are books, and I don't know what's happening. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm very glad to have gone and do all, done all that other stuff because I definitely like I could maybe figure it out, but. Yeah, definitely. I think it helps a lot. Wait, there's a number. That's five. Yeah, five-pointed star. I think that's what the five is for. So there's... Yeah. Mm. That, that place right there, I think is kind of... It's one of the, the big puzzles. Mm-hmm. Once you are over there. But there's a lot more to this room than like just that. There is. There's more to this room than meets the eye. There's a button. Welcome oh, to shit. rotating rooms. Oh shit. Hey. Same room or different room. Same room or different room. 
Uh, unclear, actually, because this was just a wall. Same room. But room. I do recommend, now that we have seen how long this uh, animation is, that you check the other path outside of this this area. Okay. Um. This one? Oh, yeah. this one just takes you to one of the islands from Mist. <laughs> I recognize that from when you played Mist. Wait, what island? Where? What? The, just the, the, the big bridge to an island that's very tall. Oh, right, yeah. Oh. So, Riley... I love that that dagger actually... <laughs> God. Is you that's you crawl so under the locked door, yeah. That's good. That's good. Because this isn't a video game where you have an inventory. What else would you do? Yeah. Hmm. In this game, rooms are the key to the kingdom. I see. Do I have to? Is this a time yeah. puzzle? No, you have you have two ways. You have to get a button into to rotate area. a room, and there's two different entrances, which means you can rotate the room to get yeah, to all I'm sorts sure. of new places. Yeah, and one of the entrances that the room has is locked. However, um, you can kind of. I mean, I don't know. Maybe there's something. I don't remember exactly how this plays out. I think there's an unlock somewhere to something. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. Because if the the locked door, yeah. And there was also a locked entrance in this one, in like that configuration you were just in. Yeah, I think this will have the locked door at the other entrance, so I'm gonna swap this again. Okay. Uh, I see. So the door. Well, will... let's look. Yeah. Okay. What happened? Mm. Yeah. I'm really glad that we have to watch this every time. Yeah. This is um. This is why I just kind of told you to go check. Because we don't need this to be longer than it has to be. Yeah, I, I ignore, I, this could have added an extra 10 minutes to the stream easy. I, Riley, I would check the people every time. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Just to be safe. Okay, I think the locked doors aren't associated because you got two free entrances. Yeah. Were there five positions? I think there were five positions. Yeah, I think so. That would make sense. Just like that star. How stars have five positions. Oh, oh yeah. Fucking stars do. Why do we think stars have... Why is, like, the five-pointed star the iconic star? It's the famous Satan star. Stars just have rays. Like, they're... They're just, like... It's just a... Dots. I mean, why do we... Did people just be making up shapes? It's fine. It's because stars, you know, especially with certain eye conditions, stars will have rays of light coming off of them, and that gives them points. Oh, like, uh, and then people are like, ah, I want to draw that pointy thing, and then they come up with the star shape. Yes. It really do be like that. I've just never seen a... a I, I, I would never... It's like the heart, right? Like, I wouldn't look at that shape in a void and be like, yeah, I associate this with this thing that it's supposed to be. Yeah, but 
humans just love to make iconography. It's fine. Yeah. Like the yeah, heart symbol. Just... It, the, the heart symbol, right, is basically just a character. It's a butt. In the same way as, like, the letter L is, right? It should be the blood symbol. Well, that's the peach emoji. My problem isn't that the symbol exists, it's that the symbol is associated with the wrong thing. The wrong uh, Well, the number, t the, the number two doesn't look like a number two. It doesn't look like two things. So you want to change that, too? No, those are just letters too. and numbers. Those are yeah. completely just like absurd and arbitrary and ridiculous. Well, so is so is R. It's the same. It's the same thing, isn't it? It's well, a, it's, a, it's a symbol it's supposed... that's used to represent something else. Yeah, but it's also supposed to be a picture. Yeah. No. Not really. But I mean, so is so is so is a letter. A letter is a picture. I'm no. sorry, Echo. I I'm, I'm contractually obligated to agree with my girlfriend. I it's, think she's going to explode. We'll it's, it's, in our, it's in our wife contract. Just I wrote a wife contract. Yeah. I was inspired by Elon. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, I guess I win this argument by default because you just said those words. <laughs> yeah, babe, you kind of threw the argument. You can't, can't really. get a tech. You got a technical foul of the argument by <laughs> comparing yourself to Elon Musk. Instant, <laughs> instant penalty. Yeah, that's an ad hominem. Yeah, Echo's gonna get three. Gonna get like four, three free throws now. Oh no. Okay, um, first throw, Echo. Go. Call me. Uh... I'm a lie. You call me, can call me any, call, any Call me sexually <laughs> promiscuous because I'm an ad hominem. Hey! Ah, I like it, I like it, I like it. Uh -huh. There we go. I'll add some hominem here. That's helpful. Thanks, babe. I really needed some more hominem. I'm running okay. low. Go to the shops. Uh, do you need any hominem? <laughs> That's like the, the little hut that that guy oh, was in. Oh. oh, so that was a lever. That was a lever. And also, to your it's right. It's fucked up that this fucking video game has both levers and stairs. I love the idea that the Riven, that the player character Riven Sequel Mist is a magical cart that Riley is pulling us all along in. <laughs> even better, Riley. Now you're stuck in a screen where you can't even watch it rotate. That's so. This is such bad stream content. I think it's good content. I love oh, no, Riley. Our viewers are down to 13 from 29 earlier. Thanks, Naya. Uh, Thanks for really. I love how Naya just exacerbates every tiny, tiny anxiety that I have that I've learned to unlearn <laughs> through. Like doing streaming I'm for doing over it as a, a year. Joke. I don't actually care. <laughs> Riley, I think, I think it's important. Like, the anxiety is part of the art. I think it's not <laughs> the art unless it feels bad to make. Look, you just you just don't make good music unless you're so depressed that like. <laughs> you... uh, uh, untrue. Feral's happy. It's fine. It's not like awful. It's just, just overexposed. I think it's a fun song. I, I, uh, I, I love like referring to a song as overexposed. Like, oh yeah, we, sorry, we put this one in the camera too long. I didn't think like any of what you guys just said came through because I was scream laughing because that really fucking got me. <laughs> the Will Ferrell set. Will Ferrell's acting. It really got me. I shrieked. I think I I I do think that Will Ferrell's Happy might be a more depressing song than most sad songs because like the the song that keeps repeating "I'm happy" has some <laughs> vibes. You know, it has some. Why do you have to convince me? That's fair. 
I believe him. I think. I think he. I think. What I think does he might be happy. the what does the 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 lever do? Now, Riley. Can we figure that out? It seems it, to it open some of the open the doors. Yeah. In this area, there's also a button. Naya. <laughs> The stripe says the player character Riven Sequelness is in reality a magical power. Oh, I just saw that now. Naya does not know the natural reaction where every Twitch viewer raid results in 90% turnover. That, yeah, that's true. I think, yeah. All right, at yeah. least since, since I complained about losing viewers, we've gone up to 15 viewers. We gained three viewers in the last five minutes, which means we're succeeding. I, okay. but it's back to 13 thing... for me, so I, I don't know. It makes me, I, I think so much about, like, how many streamers I've, like, clicked on the stream and there's this explicit rule in chat that's, like, don't tell me how many viewers I have. And we're always I, in here, like, Riley, you just lost three viewers in the last five minutes. You've got to step it up. Uh, like, it's, it's like fucking working retail. Saw... Okay, but for real, if it is making you anxious, I will just stop doing it. No, I was doing a goof. I was, it's like, it's because, like, I used to be really, like, constantly checking really anxious about it, but I don't actually care at all. This is, this is why I, I stopped fucking, uh, <laughs> you could get my art. This is why you stopped fucking? Oh, no, no. look at what Stripe said in the chat. Oh. This quarter is worth performing the usual. No, Riley. I was just going to say, this is why I stopped fucking... Looking at like fucking Twitter and shit. Anytime, like, other than like when I'm fucking posting the artwork, because otherwise yeah. I just get anxious. Like, oh, people don't like my uh, fucking latest porn comic or what fucking ever. Yeah. yeah, I get you, but I like. I think it. it's easier to just blame the beasts. Um, I I, I blame the beasts. Yeah, but like, yeah, my my problem with like shit like Twitter is uh, I can never get into the toxic relationship with numbers and analytics that anybody else can because I just can't keep up long enough to get more than like one like every couple months on a post so I'm just like sitting here like damn these people are like in a in a really fucked up spot where they're like really they're they're checking for like the likes and the retweets and shit and I'm sitting here like I don't get any of those I don't know what it's like <laughs> it's never happened. Echo Echo really wants to be in a toxic social media relationship. My, I think friend. I would be yes. a great influencer. I would like I would get canceled and then I would be like, you know what? Echo, Getting Echo. canceled is not as bad as people say it is. And I think we need to talk about that. For a, the <laughs> longest time, for years that I've known Echo, Echo has been very vocal to me about wanting to be canceled. Like, wanting to get I, big enough to be cancelled. I've already yeah. said shit on stream. Like, on stream Remember that before. thing you said that other day about stink sonas? Remember that bit? Yeah, yeah stink sonas. That was fucking disgusting. <laughs> you I was should like, be cancelled for that, I think. No, but, like, legitimate things that I think, like, if someone found, found it in a VOD, I'd be like, yeah, no, I'd be embarrassed about that. I, I'd be like, yeah, that sucks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shouldn't have no, said I that. get it. And I think that's like I've said to some degree. My trick. Yeah. There you go. Sorry. It's just to some degree. It's like yeah, if someone found that and I was big enough that it really caused a lot of problems, like that, I deserve it. I said that. Those are words I said that came out of my brain. And if it goes farther than what I deserve, then I could be like, hey. It, you know, I have experience with this now. Instead of just, like, every person who gets cancelled, except for, like, a very small number of them, are like, I have been made a pariah. It is like a witch hunt. And I'm like, I don't feel like it is, but I've never been in your situation, so I can't say that to you. Like, I maybe it is that bad. I am so still you... salty that I got kicked out of the queer Edinburgh Discord for uh, saying landlords are bad. And that was over <laughs> a year ago. <laughs> Hansel culture has gone too far on that it's one. It's gone too funny. far. It's coming for communists now. Uh, also, <laughs> Stripe says Echo is chasing the high of getting cancelled so I can get a Netflix primetime slot. You Riley, know how on. much Riley, fun Riley. it would be to what? get a Netflix primetime slot what, after man? getting cancelled? You need to write down that diagram. 
Okay. I am 100% yes. certain of this. This is a puzzle clue and you're going to forget it. Yeah. This, this, I would file this away in like shit you probably won't need for a while, but also, yeah. Definitely write down this diagram. I think it's relevant specifically because this is where you are. Yeah, it seems like it. This is who I am. Judas of my mind. <laughs> get on Tumblr so you develop an active hatred to getting any notes at all. When I get notes on Tumblr, I'm having a great time. I'm always having a great time because my friends are on there and they have uh, their fun. That said, I never should, post on there. <laughs> yeah. You should use Tumblr again. It's good. I, I love to use Tumblr genuinely. Uh, I never make original posts like just for like other people's things exclusively. That's my trick. I always I, have a problem on social media where I never reblog stuff, and I think that's bad. So I'm trying to like do both. And Tumblr is good for that because people on there are nice and post funny things. Yeah, I, it's a good, good website. Yeah, I, I, I did make a very good joke on there once uh, that I still think about. Uh, I can, I can tell it. Was that Splat Tim? Uh, did no, you I invent Splat Tim? I didn't make, I didn't invent Splat Tim. I can't believe Dom invented Splat Tim. I genuinely, I'm gonna be honest. I genuinely thought you did. No, he doesn't. I, I didn't, I didn't invent Splat Tim. I did invent. I'm trying to think if there's any. I don't know. I, I invented lots of jokes. What was the funny Tumblr post you made, though? Well, it was. So I used to. So it was. Uh, the more you. It was. What was it? I, <laughs> the bigger you are, the larger you are? The bigger you are, the larger you are. Classic. You know what they I've say? I've never seen that. It's it's just a, it just says you know what they say the bigger you are the larger you are and I've been thinking about this like so anyway I used to work in an airport so which means I would be up until like fucking five in the morning so to pass the time what I would do is I would leave weird fucking voicemails for my little sister and uh, right phone her in the middle of the night and say things like you know what they say the bigger you are the larger you are or in this Hasn't world that you're such hasn't that sibling changed gender since then uh she they oh, okay but yeah Continue, um, sorry i was just checking yeah or like you know what they say uh in this world you're either homeless and homery or homeless and hungry and anyway uh she changed her phone number so i tried to phone them up and just like one time like they actually answer, I'm like, oh, hiya, sorry, I hope I didn't wake you up. They're like, who is this? It's a bloke's voice. I'm like, oh, I was just calling Harry. And they're like, who? I'm like, oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm just, so I turned out, I'd just been like, leaving like, fucking dumb voicemail. I don't think, I, I don't think they changed the phone number because, uh, I, I think they did. Them. No, I, no, think no. They I don't think they did. I, I think they changed it because they were estranged and didn't want my dad phoning them. But yeah. Oh, fair, fair, fair. Uh, it was, but no, I, I, I still think about that. That's my, that's my, that's my. Uh, the bigger you are, the larger you are. Story. That's a good story. Thanks. I like that. Thanks, um, the bigger your story, the larger your story. Yeah. Yeah, I just get notes on Tumblr posting about Armored Core, I guess, because it's 2023. Yeah, and hey. everybody loves Armored Core these days. Only in 2023. They really, like, made that, that core, like, particularly impervious to damage. Yeah. It's quite armored. Yeah. It's got lots of armor. Is communist like an umbrella term now? I see, I see what... What Road Gaunt said in the chat a little bit ago. I, I mean, I'm anarchist, but I say communist because it's uh, a heavier and skittier sounding word. <laughs> yeah, I've 
I've always said like it's also completely anar- wrong, Dom. <laughs> I've I've described myself as an anarchist since I before I knew what that meant, that word meant. Um and uh I I just like remember there being a distinct delineation a lot of people made between like usually when you say communist, you don't mean anarchist. But there's oh, still no, you, you can be both kind like word wise. Yeah. Um, um, I'm not a political theory knower to the point that I'm, I'll, I would like to get into a discussion on the positives and negatives of either. I think generally, if you're one of those, you're probably chill. I'm probably okay with you. Yeah. Um, I think especially in the United States, on Twitter, you know anarchist doesn't always mean like anarchist communist or like anarchist socialist or fucking... Mm-hmm. Uh, that's oh yeah, we are libertarians that call themselves anarchists too, and and caps. I, I like if I to see, think if I see a libertarian, I, I I I look at them and then I say, "Be gone!" and then they vanish from this time. And they're see, the thing is, the world. if someone calls themselves an anarchist and then they out themselves as an ancap, I just get to laugh at them. So I think it's it's fun. Yeah, my girlfriend loves. My girlfriend I loves. Do. That's good. It's good that your girlfriend loves. It would be hard to have a girlfriend, I think, if she didn't love. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, sorry, the reason that was very awkward is because I uh, sent my girlfriend out of just because I'm talking to Dom, this is a thing I say a lot, and then realized the thing I actually meant to respond to was the thing Echo said, and realized that would sound really weird because we're not... <laughs> <laughs> I understand, though. I've done that sort of thing before. Yeah, yeah and nobody... that's why I had to stop that sentence immediately. <laughs> I feel like, uh, John, I feel like saying that, like, basically the idea that it's easier to communicate the idea of communism with its words than anarchism is a l- putting a little too true. much faith in anybody who is, like, centered to right. I um, I think anarchism is quite easy to explain, right? It's just, yeah, I don't think anyone should be the boss of anyone else. Yeah, and like... It's, it's understandably more complicated than that, though. It's oh, yeah, more complicated like, than that's... that, but the base premise is there. And like, the, the people who are like edgy or misguided or just wrong about stuff and using the word is like, they still have like the base premise, they just haven't thought about it with their brain. Um... Yeah, I think you can think about communism a lot with your brain and fuck it up. Yeah, I mean, there there has been a decades long political project to obfuscate what communism even is. So yeah, yeah. yeah. I would say anarchism is a part of that. Although the punk movement, I think, was pretty grassroots in how it was fucking up that stuff. What does this thing even do? It makes that guy... I, I I mostly meant like the cold the cold war and red scare. Yeah. Yeah. It's just like anarchy became a word that was used for chaos, I think, around the same time. Yeah. It just wasn't as demonized as calling people communist or socialist, I guess too. I don't know when that happened. Yeah. Oh, there's a fucking lever. Lever. I hardly even know her. Yeah. So I, I will. You. You're right. Good idea. Oh my god, stare. But I hardly even know her. Oh my god, stare. More like lever. Get it? What the fuck are you talking about? What does that mean? <laughs> no, it's what are you like, talking you can about? Her, you can... Her. You can you can stay or you can leave. You can stay uh, and leave. You can would you stay left, or would you go? Uh, Riley, are you trapped in the stair zone? <laughs> no, I'm just doing a puzzle. What are, you puzzle doing bad- are you doing it well or badly? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just sort of hoping. Oh, hey, it's that guy's container. There's a button as well? 
Oh. Open. Open this. Break this. Oh, this break noise this is for me. great. Destroy lid. Open lid. Open it. Open it. Open it. Open it. I have never tried to do this without the combination to the lid. This is such a funny noise. It's not opening. I'm just so fucking mad. I don't know what the combination of this lid is because it's just five identical Riley. squares. Can I give you a little hint? Yeah, please, I want a hint so bad. Don't worry about that lid until literally the end of the game. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna cry. I know what the fuck. I really was worried Riley would have just closed the stream. <laughs> oh, um, that would have been really funny, though. Is the thing. Hey! Uh, if you're in the chat, say something funny right now. Oh, fuck, That's man. That's right, I'm on. putting all 13 of our viewers on the spot. Make a joke. Something Thanks, funny. <laughs> Wait, you're not a viewer. You're a Dalmationer. In fucking... I'm also in the stream, so I'm viewing. That's pretty funny. You're pretty funny. Oh, thanks. Oh shucks. I say this all the time. Oh shucks. That's me when I that's me when none I none of our thirteen corn. viewers made a joke. At the cornfield. That's what I say when I'm huh? in the cornfield. The cornfield is where they spends all of her time. This stream yeah. is brought to you by the E B D B Foundation, dedicated to all of the E B D Bs who can't catch a break. Thanks, guy. Is that is that a joke or is that real? Is this stream brought out? I, if, if news to me. I mean, like, not up to you, is it? Portion of a Roman aqueduct made out of hand The pieces fit together tightly enough to be airtight and act as an inverted siphon, carrying water down one they side of an the valley and up the other. It's very. It's very Don't. Sorry, my toad brain activates at 22.30 and shuts down by like 1 and we're past that. Yeah. What do you mean? It's 8.25 p.m. What do you mean? It's 12.26 using... p.m. Hey, do you guys know that I start to stream at 10 a.m. in the morning? Do you think about that? About the fact that I'm doing puzzles at 10 a.m. in the morning? Yeah, and you're so, uh... Good at it. Yeah. Okay. All right. Don't fucking break your back. <laughs> no, I would never do that. I'm, I'll break your back. Ah. Yeah. Uh. Hey, the sound Echo. is celery breaking. Echo, can yeah. I get a hint on what the fuck I can do right now? Because I don't know what the fuck I can do. Um. Go back into the big room. I don't know if this is real or not, but I want to. I'm gonna go check. and get some naan bread. Okay. Is the can you go to the other corner? Because the door is kind of weird to see in the corner of the room, right? right? My girlfriend loves her nan. I think you have to walk towards the doorway once to see the corners. Nope. Okay. Um. I would leave this island. I'm trying to remember how you get to the the elevator. I'll be honest. I'm not a hundred percent. Oh wait, no. no, 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 no. Yeah, you you're going the right way. The okay. thing you're doing right now is good. Sorry, I was saying no. Because that's what I say when I, like, remember something. Yeah. So, the area with the town in the woods and the minecart that leads you to the reservoir thing, that that island? 
that I think you're going to right now has more stuff in it. I think it's in the woods. I think there's more stuff you can do in the woods. Yeah, I kind of felt like I didn't do a whole lot there. That's because you didn't. Thanks. Yeah. Got him. There is also a, a hidden path in the woods. Um, oh. It's hidden enough that I don't really mind spoiling it too much because it's. I think it's just a dead end path that you have to. One more. There's also something else you can do in the lake region, but you'll never figure it out on your own. And there's no yeah. hints in it that I can tell. But it's important. But I think you should try yes. to figure it out on yes. your own. And Yes. 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 Oh, they're friends. It's a stealth segment. Yeah, now you have to grab these birds. Um, they're friends. Riley. What? Did I fuck it you up? turned away. You turned away. Fuck. They're dead now. You have, you have to keep approaching them. I just couldn't figure I thought I wasn't at the right place to jump the rail yet. Oh well. I'll do it later. No, oh, yeah, you just go straight towards them. Good thought though. Hint, there's something important you need to do, Riley. You haven't done it yet. Thank you, John. You're the only person here who cares about giving me hints. Oh, the Riven remake is going to be so cool because you're going to be able to walk around. Whoa. Like, there's been real mist. But, so, like, walking around in, like, the mist remake wasn't as big of a deal. Whoa. That sounds like the funny dinosaurs. Mm -hmm. And that's, okay, maybe... I believe, the number... Um, four. I think you're right. it's nine minus four, five. It sounds Can right you believe me. it? Can you believe it, Echo? I'm solving a math puzzle by myself. Yeah, it's like counting. It's like kindergarten yeah. math puzzle. Yeah, you're well, doing shut your fucking mouth. <laughs> Echo is so mean to Riley. This sort is, of a devil's creature. Yeah. To be fair, the kindergartners at my school are doing fucking times tables by the end of the year. So That's impressive. I can is that, that true? Yeah, shout out to Marie Montessori for like being smart. Holy shit. Um, I'm, like a... I'm gonna dox this kindergartner. No, uh, Marie Montessori invented the Montessori method, which is what oh. my school uses. It's a method of teaching kids where, like, I don't know how elementary works as much, but I'm pretty sure it puts, like, whole chunks of kids in the same classroom so that they can learn, like, interacting with people of different ages. You get, like, the sibling mechanism where like they the the older ones can help the younger ones and it teaches like independence and emotional intelligence and all this good stuff it's neat Heck it's yeah cool. good for good for the kids and they learn math really like early it's cool okay. yeah no i I do agree, Cyborg. The Riven remake is going to look worse just because it doesn't look like this, uh, and you can't beat this, but it's still probably going to be a better game to that, play for like, most people. The ground here is gorgeous. Oh, no. Oh, Riley. What? One more I'm clicking so no, much. No, 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 no. I said one more click, and then you click twice. You gotta go walk back under the bridge. And then turn around. Turn around again. Uh, I meant like all of it. Okay. No, no. Look at the fish. There are two things on your screen besides the fish there. They're really not 
color. Oh, yeah. Boobs. Oh, this is cool. I love this. Yeah, thank you for pointing that out to me, Echo, because I had to like squint and lean forward onto my screen. Yeah, that's pixel hunting. Like, not. Yeah. <laughs> this is going to go in my ribbon hit piece. Well, uh, you're wrong, because it's cool. It opens the cool mouth. Stop. It's for E time. Get in that mouth. It's the elevator. Whoa, it's just like mist. Whoa. Just this like is a lot less confusing than the mist station that does this. Yeah. It's mist, isn't it? Wait, we haven't seen a skeleton yet. I really hope that Ruben has a skeleton in it. If it doesn't, I'm going to be so sad. I'm trying to remember if it does. The thing is, is that I was surprised that Mist had a skeleton in it. Yeah. If it, it has to either have a skeleton or a bike. <laughs> <laughs> Which one do you think is more likely? I have no idea. Oh, I see. I should have been drawing the eye symbols. No. Oh. Riley, I want to tell you the way that this game is implemented makes it very obvious where you should press the button. I see. <laughs> it is not supposed to do that, but it sure does. Fuck. Fuck. I missed it again. Yeah. It's like clear where you should press a button, but it's still kind of an awkward. Did that not work? Damn. <laughs> You're so close. Why is it not working? Okay, yeah. got it. Wee. Now that's mist. Now that's mist. An orb that does that, that's mist. An orb with no nipple. Finally, it's mist. I want to slap this thing so bad. I want to just yeah, slap this, the shit out of this thing. God, me too. So it's good that you crank did this. Up, crank it up. But yet crank another up combination lock. God. Well, cool. Cool puzzle. Well, there's a, there's a book in there, though. Wait, so. It's like a little wind frosted glass. Oh, yeah, that is a book. Well, that seems book. important. Yeah. Oh, shit. What's up, dude? What's up, dude? Damn, everyone's just trying to go about their day and the tornado siren keeps fucking going off. Cause this fucker who just comes in and fiddles with knobs. And slaps slaps big orbs like bongos. Slaps big orbs like bongos. Same guy though. Bones room. Bones room. 
Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. I love oh, this because it's oh, just this like this is cool as hell. This is cool as hell, and also I'm a little horrified because I'm afraid of heights just a tiny bit. It... Yeah. I think that makes it so that you can go there. Yeah. I think that does the ladder uh, as well, if I remember okay, correctly. Ooh. I love the just like this is a lot of time and effort to just allow you to access one place, but it's just so cool. You yeah. like get a different perspective on a lot of stuff you've seen already. And you see the orb. Yeah. I was also a little scared here because I'm also a bit scared of heights. Though, in practice, I'm more scared of, like, small heights than huge heights. Like, if I'm up on a tree, I will, like, be scared to fucking death. But if I'm on top of a very tall building, I'm just kind of like, this is a little anxiety-inducing, but not quite as bad. I... Really? What? I... I think like a small height sometimes feels. Oh my god, that's cool! I love the yeah. evil mouth door. Evil mouth door. I love, I love. Wait, hold. Did this fucking did this fucking like Wizard of Oz motherfucker just make a hell? <laughs> did he just make a hell? No, this is just an elevator. This is just yet another altar to the big fish. Yeah. Oh, right. It does kind of look more evil than, like, the other ones, though. But I guess I don't actually know what this fish represents. Uh, also... Echo, you were gonna say something? The ele I... <sighs> the elevator it goes two ways. It looks a little older. The elevator goes two ways? Uh, because you click and drip. Oh, wait, that took it. Okay, I see now. I see that I ex I dragged it to the middle and not the bottom. I couldn't tell because of the shadow. Yeah. Um. I think that's on purpose. I think they want you to go up first. Mm -hmm. But. It's like the place that you just unlocked is so far away from this. Yeah. That I wanted to be like, you can also go down. A submersible is very slow. Yeah, at least it's all set up, though. Yeah. Yeah, you can always come back. <coughs> we we Yeah. There's so many good like looks so things. good. Yeah. Yeah. We are on a new disc yet again. Remember this how there was the number four, four discs? Yeah, that's Remember fun. how there was a number five in that rotating room and there was a a place yeah. that seemed to have that indicated that it was connected to five places? Tiny fucking button. I'm going to have to play this myself to see it without the stream compression. Yeah, I'm 
and definitely recommend buying it because it seems just like is yeah there it's on there? Or is that just a hole no in in the box the buttons in the box to the left oh i see i didn't realize this was a box yeah that's the thing is like the art style is going to be a little disappointing to me as someone a fan of like this game but also i guarantee if they remake riven the buttons are going to be very obvious yeah um the little the little quirks of everything being kind of same color will probably get ironed out This is the cool elevator. It's like a dungeon elevator. Yeah, I feel like I'm in Elden Ring. Like, this is like an Elden Ring. Like, I'm like, gonna fight Praetor Rikard or something. Sorry, I'm a gamer. I can only make references to video games. It's okay, it's okay. Yeah. Uh, I've seen this um, movie, it's called Boss Baby. Oh, yeah. That's just like Elden Ring. Mm -hmm. This is the station I always remember. Because it's the one where you can uh, exit on both sides. Yeah, that's neat. Is this the same station I was at before, or no? Uh, no, I don't believe so. Huh. I wonder where it goes. If you were switching the CDs, you would have explored here more. Yeah, but I can just be as careless and I can be as frivolous as I like. Yes. Oh. Oh. New place. Kind of. Kind of. It's, it looks similar to the first one. Oh, yeah. No, this. I'll let it slide. We'll see what's up. Got a good view of oh, the big yes. orb. Wait. Am I right? No, I think I'm wrong. What the fuck? Hee 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 hee. Man. This shit sucks. So you do. You do have to notice the funny thing that I was laughing about earlier. <sighs> That's so funny. I'm not going to notice Wait. it. I'm going to be yeah, stuck when, in purgatory then, hell forever. The next time you're there, we'll just I'll I'll start on it. I, I mean, I want to slide some funny hints to kind of build the tension, but... <laughs> I should post yeah. this every time you change a disc? Yeah, no, you should. You have to post it again. Is this a, is this a whole disc? You have to change a whole disc for this? Yeah. God. E yeah. Each island is a disc, if I remember correctly. But, I think I'm gonna have a pizza for lunch today. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm gonna go have a wrap. A Caesar salad chicken wrap. Fuck you. Caesar salad? I hardly know her. I'm a posser salad once I'm done with it. What? Hang on. Oh, this is like such a, this is a great screen. Yeah, yeah. I love okay. this island.
There's also a button in this elevator. Yeah, I see it. Okay. <laughs> that is the thing I am not keeping from you. Oh man, the music stopped. I remember oh, these it's a shapes. Map. Shit. Friday loves a map! It's her favorite thing! When she looks at a map, she must sing! Wee! Sing the map, Riley. Those... It's a map. It's a map. I love to use a map. This isn't a rap, because I don't rap. But I love to use a map. Echo's got Hell a yeah. rap. It's a Caesar salad chicken rap. And then I'm gonna give Riley's bald head a slap. I'm not bald! You will be when I'm done with you. You can fucking try. I like that these are using the fucking, like, simulation thing for Mists 1. Riley, thank you for this time that I put you on the spot to sing a song actually doing it. <laughs> You're During long, long, you were often a coward about it. Well, but, I don't know how to tell you that not everyone is blessed with your amazing No, 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 I know, I know. Right, I know, I know. I'm just teasing. Sorry, was that too, too no, much? No, you're fine. You're fine. I'm, I'm just fighting back. <laughs> That's um, fair. So. It is interesting that it's doing that thing from Mist 1, but it's also doing that thing from Riven, because there's been water manipulation throughout this whole game. Sure. Just mostly subtractive. I is love this, how this on this screen it's just completely illegible. Oh, are these like, would I actually be able to see what is, like, would I actually be able to see things if I was down there? It affects something. Okay. God, that takes so long. That took yeah. so long. It sure does. I don't think I'm going to be using this very much. This is very useful if you get stuck, I would say. What, what Yo. is What is this? It's, a map. it's one of those pin things that you can yeah. put your hand in. Mm -hmm. So this is the island that you're on because that first one was the the spikes, right? Which I think is lucky. Yeah, it's true. So this allows you to look at the topography of the islands because at a certain point, there might be things that you want to look for. Mm -hmm. um, in this island, it's not super hard to find. I think it's here, but if you're wrong. Hmm, you do. But this allows, if you get stuck trying to find stuff, you can come here and you can be like, well, I haven't found a thing on this island, so you can queue up the island and look for it. Did you end up writing the eye on the other one? Did you end up writing it down? No. This thing is not even looking at it anyway. Yeah, it still does the little freeze thing, but it's kind of a nightmare. Um, wow, you got it. Holy shit. I am shocked that I got that. Riley opened so, up a big eye? Question mark? I'm pretty sure when you open them, you can also close them by hitting the button again interesting um i want to say because they're all kind of the same thing i guess 
it's more obvious that there's a book in this one. Nope. Don't you got it. Need the combination. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's basically what like this island is mostly an informational island, I feel like. Mm -hmm. And it's like a nice crossroads because you can get to a couple places. Now, which place is this big island? I think that's the one with the. It would have to be the one with the jungle and shit, right? Because that one has the most stuff. Yeah, it's probably the Dunny Island. That's Dunny, right? That's Dunny. No. Dunny is where Atris is. Ah, right. Cave. It's also where uh, Uru is. If you end up playing Miss Sunline Uru Live, that takes place oh. in Dunny. The like, uh, in the universe explanation for it is that like people are trying to restore Dunny um, because the Dunny people have moved on and are living somewhere else now. Mm. So there's a bunch of like people who have kind of moved in and are trying to restore the city to live in. Uh, and that's who you are, person with cowboy hat and missed on my new life. I love how long this cutscene takes after everything has stopped moving. It's good. I think more cutscenes should take one million years. Just the person not doing it. Okay, yeah. I need to find this fucking secret that my good friends and co-streamers Echo and Nay are keeping from me. What do you need? What do you need us to do? <laughs> no, don't do anything. Once you at, <laughs> once you say though. The what? This isn't helpful at all. What yeah, did it isn't. Riley ask? I was asking Riley's... about. I was saying that I need to reveal my the secret that you've been keeping from me. This, this evil yeah. secret. I will oh. say the secret isn't going to be helped by this. Yeah. Okay. This island. Um, yeah. The, this island this is island specific. Would not help you at this all. one's fucked up. Yeah. They fucked this one. But you have at least one other place that you can definitely go without asking for us to spoil the secret. Because you went up the elevator. Yeah. Well, Well, what are you waiting for, Riley? What? Oh, I was uh, looking at a different screen. How could you? I certainly wasn't looking at a different screen as well. <laughs> Creation is a cutscene that's taken 4.6 billion years. Yeah, the four point, the journey of 4.6 billion years. I guess that's the theory of evolution. Very true. Did you pull the lever? No. I forgore. <laughs> I forgore. It's gonna be really exciting when I translate these notes to 
MS Paint because you're gonna see all the fucking doodles that I do. Cause I'm gonna include those. Yeah, for oh, sure. A fucking course. We love it. We love a doodle. We love a doodle from O'Reilly. We love Spryly. We love it when she. Riley doodles. Yeah. We love it when she Riley doodles on her doodle dude. And she scribbles, and she scratches, and she doodles, and she, uh, does another drawing oh, never word. Been that one joke. Okay, all right, joke, cool. Um, yeah. what do you call fucking sex? Buttons. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, bro. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks. We love joke. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. The best chair in the game. Yes. Evil chair. Whoa. I see. There's just these two, these two things to look at. I don't know where yeah. this is. What is? I think that's the classroom. It could be the classroom. It looks like it has stuff that was in the town. Yeah, but I don't think it's the classroom. Yeah, maybe not. It's got too many barrels and shit. There would theoretically be a chair for the classroom. Yeah. Oh, this is a lot. Yeah. Can rotate it somehow. Oh, there we go. Oh, you just click on it. I see. Yeah, you click on the rings in the outer outside. Whoa. It's the fish. the fish. So how would you describe the sound it just made? Chicago. I mean, you're the one who has to write it down. Yeah. I want to let you know, you can keep doing this. Not like an elephant. Kinda, yeah. I love this fish. Yeah. I honestly, miss I have no animals, and that's a big plus with this game. 
I think you should keep calling the fish, honestly. It's really cool. <laughs> Riley, like... <laughs> <laughs> Riley doesn't want to fuck up this fish this fish situation by accident. So angry. Yeah, break this guy's house. Break it. Yeah. Him. No. I'm out of fish. He gets mad and never comes back. <laughs> Wait, he never comes back? I actually don't know. He won't come back at least until you leave. I don't know if you can make him come back by like switching islands or something. Mm. Yeah, he gets pissed off. Angry fish. It's kind of like an angry bird, but no wings. Not as effective at knocking over structures. Yeah, not effective at pig murder. Isn't that so wacky? The birds What's are wacky? killing pigs. Why are the birds killing pigs? I don't Isn't know. Isn't that just kind of wacky? Um. Well, the. The, the Icky Birds movie uh, makes it kind of a race thing. What? What? It does. The mm. Icky Birds movie, I'm sorry to say, is like really weirdly anti Muslim. What, what the fuck? What? <laughs> no! No, they can't be equating fucking pigs with that, are they? I'm afraid to say yeah. They can! What? What the fuck is the Angry Birds movie about? What the f I think we just told you what it's about. I guess, I... yeah. Like... God. It's the only fucking safe thing in this world, the Emoji Movie. <laughs> Thanks, Echo. That, hey, that, you know that, what that reminds me of? What? That reminds me of Will Ferrell's song, Happy. Is that in the Emoji Movie? No, it just makes me think about it. I think it should have been in the Emoji Movie. They could have had, like, yeah, the happy Yeah, because it's emoji. literally the whole point, is that he doesn't, he wants to express more emotions. Oh, okay, yeah. I've never seen that movie. I was just, like, bringing I it up. I haven't seen... I have not seen the Emoji movie. I just know the plot I, of it. I feel like I've talked to people who've seen the Emoji movie, and none of them told me it was problematic, which, to me, translates into it's not a problematic movie. It's not problematic so much as it is bad. I think it's just bad. I think it's not a good but movie. But that's, like, the good kind of bad, right? Yeah. Like, unproblematic or bad like, is a thing I don't to appreciate. feel like a bad person while I'm watching it. It's like the person that, like, you just don't like, but there's nothing wrong with them. And you're just like, I don't want to hang out with this person. Those people, yeah, that's great. The I'm, movie. Glad they, I'm glad they... I'm glad those people... <laughs> Scary. Baby moment. Oh, it's like that thing in Layers of Fear. This is just like Layers of Fear or The Seventh Guest. All babies running away from you are the same. <laughs> All babies are scary. A bass. A bass. I'm here for Bay Bass. Hey, you're just gonna have to sound the alarm again. Yeah. 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 These people are just trying to go about their day. They're just trying to, to go about their puzzles. fucking day. I'm just, just trying, trying to go trying about to my fucking... day, and my day involves solving puzzles for my beautiful stream viewers on Cable 2. 
But they're just trying to live their goddamn lives, you know? Maybe I'm trying to live my goddamn life, and my goddamn life is as a puzzle solving professional. I they think the term is puzzles. puzzle whiz. Yeah, that's true. They just put too many puzzles on their frickin' island. They should have put it... less puzzles. I mean, most of the puzzles seem to be very mechanical, whereas, like, this town is mostly made out of more natural materials. True. Oh, now that Riley's in the area, you should give uh, her a hand. Well, no, I'm in a different area no. right now. No, Riley's not in the area yet. Riley's doing the other thing. I just want to do this thing, and then, so I can remember that I have to do it, and then I'm gonna go to that area and find out what the fuck you guys are talking about, and then that'll probably be the stream, depending on how I feel. Yeah. I feel like there's still a way to bypass knowledge. I feel like there's still gotta be something. But I could be wrong. Oh, I have a really good, like, poetic hint that would probably just give you the solution, too. Mm. I'm gonna bust that out when it's time. Okay. Fuck! No, okay. I don't know how to get that to come down. Wait! Have you ever gone there the other direction? No, that wouldn't matter. That wouldn't matter. How would I get there? I mean, like, turning around and going the other direction. But I don't think that would do anything. Yeah. I was just thinking of, like, if you turn the if you turn the thing around, would it work? But I don't think, I don't think that's real. I mean, I guess I can try. Yeah, so there's probably just, like, a... You you came from what is now the left, but have you been everywhere here except for this place? I think so. I wasn't paying attention when you were Like I went to the training school, her. I went to I tried to go to this place. I don't know where else there is. Oh, yeah, and then there's the lever room. Yeah. The, like, five that. levers. Yeah. Nope. Yeah, I know. I can't believe they're taking the baby bonk from the Layers of Fear remake. It's so sad. Yeah. I mean, that game's it's not good to begin with, but yeah. When you see somebody having fun with something and your re react response is to patch it out, it's like... Man... I understand from the perspective of, like, competitive shit, but when it's just, like, goofy shit like that... I mean, I kind of get it because, like, it sort of, it undercuts the the scare of the scene, you know. Yeah, but, but, but Layers I, of Fear I, I, isn't a good horror game anyway, so. But there's like the um, the thing that's like the closest thing to horror is comedy. Um, how the fuck do I get up there? Yeah, for sure. So like. I think having like a funny thing in the middle of your horror game and undercutting it a little bit is good actually. So because why? like if you can make someone laugh and then scare them while they're laughing, it's even better. Mm -hmm. For sure. Then that's I, fair. I definitely like feel like I can do something here, but I just don't know what the steps are. I feel like it has to do with the lever puzzle, but I don't know what the lever puzzle is even is. It probably has to do with a lever puzzle, but I don't remember how the lever puzzle works. So I can't even help you with that. Well, let's go 
get tormented by Echo's riddles three. It's usually when I give Riley a riddle, Riley's like, "Oh, I get it." Yeah. So it's because I'm smart and good at puzzles. Yeah. Okay. I think it's pretty easy to fake being scared, John. I fake being scared all the time. Pretty much every uh, time you see me scared, I'm faking it. Never actually scared. Oh, okay. It doesn't happen. When I get, like, startled and I jump and I go, eh, that's, I'm not scared. Wow, big non-scared gamer over here. Yeah. I stopped playing in the middle of Amnesia the Dark Descent when I was trying to play it back when it was new because uh, it just wasn't scary, it was kind of boring. Yeah. Sounds about right. I'm so ready for this wrap. So ready for this pizza that I'm gonna have. Just but I'm more game. ready for Riley to understand for a moment. Huh? I just wanted to see what doing this does. Does it make this thing work? If I turn this thing on now, the wood chipper. Can I jump in the chipper? I, I don't think you can do that because I don't think... Mist has like bad ends, but it doesn't have death. You know? It doesn't have like... You fucked up in the middle of the game and died. Yeah. Cringe ass adventure game. This is why nobody liked it. And everyone yeah. was like, this is the worst video game ever made. That's what everyone said about this game. Yeah, Amnesia was so fucking boring. I, I agree, like, yeah, it's like, you get so bored, you just piss your pants. Yeah. That happens to me all the time. Hang on, hold on, hang on. I feel like I'm misrepresenting myself with that. Um, <laughs> let me tell... <laughs> hey, Echo. The, for whatever that? reason it occurs, I do not regularly piss my pants. I'm going on record. That doesn't happen. Can someone clip the bit before Echo said that, where Echo said that it happens to it all the time? No, no. Can someone clip no. that and then post it, like, in, at Echo's Tumblr and, like... What? The, no. Not on my Tumblr. Yeah. Can someone just post that, please? Not on Cable 2 Discord, either. Don't do it. I'm... I'm waiting. Also, Echo, give me your fucking no. hints. I don't know I if no I'm giving you... What I'm doing. Okay, um, here's a, here's a hint. <clears throat> um, uh, shit, what was I gonna say? When, it's, it's what they say about life, Riley. Uh, away. yeah. Um, when one door closes, another opens. It's just like what they say <laughs> about life. <laughs> when one door closes, another one opens. I don't know why I did that. Thanks, Naya. Thanks, Naya. You're welcome. That one. I don't think I can open and close this door. I think I can just go through it. I don't remember. Oh, I'm seeing it now. I'm. I, yeah, I'm glancing too. Wiggling my eyebrows. Wiggling. I, I'm receiving the wiggling. Wiggle. Uh, man, Wiggle Dance is such a catchy kid song. Can I just shout out to the Wiggle Dance? What the fuck are you talking about? 
it's like a kid's song. You can probably find it on YouTube. It's just these guys. Just, well, the door dude, closed behind it's... me, so that's not it. This is honestly like the bread and butter of puzzle solving is like receiving kind of a a a hint like this and then trying all of your options. Well, I don't know of any other options. Oh wait, this is a door. I forgot that, that was a door. And now just like a hole. Mm. <laughs> really yeah, trying making... not to say anything. Yeah, I'm gonna it's... fucking rip no, I... both of your tendons <laughs> to pieces. You're making me so fucking angry. I'm gonna You're close. My pants. You're close You're... is what I'll say. <laughs> but in a way that's stupid. Not you, the game. I don't think the game is stupid, but I also don't think Riley is stupid. I think this is understandable because I didn't give a hint that's specific to what Riley's missing. Riley's like investigated. Do you need a, a hint level two for me, Riley? Or do you feel that you could still investigate some more things? No, Riley is puzzled brains in effect. You're fucking kidding. This <laughs> game sucks ass. That's dog uh -huh. shit of There's dog. There's one on the other side, too. Shit yeah. of ass dog. Yeah. This is the fucking missed puzzle at the beginning of the game again, where it's like, <laughs> oh, you have to hold the button down, idiot. <laughs> oh. Man, remember Universal Hint System? That was such a good walkthrough hint format. I don't actually know what you're talking about. I'm curious. There is a universal hint system in Mist 4. Uh, I remember it being not super great. I think Millennium might have been being sarcastic, but I don't know enough about what... They no, universal about. hint system is an old system of hints that, w that often existed for, like, adventure games, where, like, you would have a hint that, like, gives you, like, oh, like, here's the first step towards the thing. Here's, like, an indirect hint that gets you there. And then, like, mm -hmm. here's a slightly more direct hint that tell that tells you a little more of what you actually need to do. And then, like, here's a third hint that basically just tells you the thing you need to do. You I know? See. I forgot that that's how that works. Yeah, it's good. Remember this door? Yeah. But, like, in a different place? Yeah. It's the biggest boob of all. The large orb. We have to slap it, Riley. I want to slap it so bad. Fuck! No, no, there's a lever. What? Oh. I know it seems like there's not a lever. But there is just a lever. Oh, hey, now I'm back here. Welcome back. We'll be... Do I have... Would you have to change discs in between that? Uh, I'm pretty sure, yeah. God, that's funny. All right. Oh, Ooh. there's a button. Ruin really is the buttons game. It's the buttons game. Just like Blaze Blue. Just like. Blaze Blue. That sounds like a Blaze Blue intro, like the fight, <laughs> fight intro. Wow, ready to run. Now, just like we have blue. unlocked just like a Blaze Blue. Significant Fuck. pathway. Yeah. Hey yo. Cool. Well, but let us not let it leave our brain, actually the handle that we turned back on that other island true if you need to write it down sorry i'm just because we might this orb do you guys see the tiny little square around this orb that i'm gracing with my fingertip right now yeah it's really funny I'm it like... is like not there at all on like original hardware that this game would have run on but mm -hmm. With the remakes, it's just like, yep, yeah, there it is.
this ABI or whatever. Yeah. Well, yeah, I'm just, I said that was where we were going to end, so I'm going to end. I'm going to write down Leaper on Reservoir Island. Fuck you, Echo. I'm blaming you for that puzzle, by the way, being bad. I'm gonna write that in my yeah. in, in my ribbon hit in my ribbon hit piece. I'm excited about the ribbon hit piece. Look, Riley. I think the door is funny. Well, they call well, Riley the ribbon hater funny. for a reason. That's true. That is what they call me. They call me Riley the Rivenator. That's kind Riley of the, like Rivenator. It's kind of like Riley the Riveter. Like the the labor icon. Who? Rosie the Riveter. Oh, right, yeah. We can do I it. I was thinking of Riley. I was like, who's Riley? What? Uh, the Riley the Riveter is... It, or Riley the Rivener is is a much more unknown kind of pairing with Splat Tim, because while Splat Tim he does it, Riley the Rivener, we can do it. Wow. <laughs> and with that, I think, I think that's a good stream. I think we did the stream. Thank you, everyone, who watched today, and for all of my beautiful co-hosts who joined me on this Riven adventure, this Rivening adventure, <laughs> uh, and uh, hopefully we'll be here next week, or at least, well, definitely me and I. Uh, I might. We'll see. All right. New highlights video is coming out right now. I believe that's a long haul highlights, which is exciting. That was a good stream, hey. and I hope you all are excited to explore the beautiful island of Riven and see more puzzles. Uh, I am. I'll pay more attention next time, I promise. You pay plenty of attention. It's fine. Uh, and next time, you'll be able to see me doing my notes live. I'm going to have to, like, I'm going to, like, move edit the overlay so I can just have, like, a portion of the screen that's, like, Riley's notes section. Um, oh fuck, I went on, I opened the Cable 2 Twitch page, like, on my computer, and so I was hearing myself for, like, a tiny bit. That was terrifying. Okay, anyway, uh, thank you for watching, VOD will be up, the, watch the new highlights video, and... And Goobaba. Bye. <laughs> Goobaba? Goobaba. Yeah? What? Yeah! Yeah! Goobaba. I don't understand what you're so confused about. I'm not confused about anything. It makes perfect sense. Good night, everyone. Goobaba. Goobaba.